Okay, I'm now waiting. Yeah, they've been, it's been else. messy. I'm going to like it. Who else here? Going live. Oh, that was fast. We're live. Oh, damn. Already? Yeah. Insta live. Ooh, yeah. And we were, Already. what, seven minutes early? Eight minutes early? Oh, even more than that. 11 minutes early. Well, kind of. Uh, let me mute this commercial on my I'm side. Uh, what is going on, Internet? Welcome to Only Comps. Uh, I get to hear an echo, or is that me? That was just me making sure the stream was up. Based. If you guys have any audio issues, let us know uh, in the comments below. But today, we are doing our body warm cam breakdown, as we do on Thursdays. We are hosted here graciously by the bassist of the people on the internet, and that is Bill, the real top. Uh, I'm, like, I'm like beard. top 10. Okay. At least. Yeah. At least. <laughs> <laughs> um, we are uh, the meat between our buns is producer Juan. He's the one that makes things pretty. Uh, and uh, like my beard he makes my beard pretty. He does make his beard. It's, pretty. Like it's completely like photoshopped. Yeah. Um, it's all, and then this is a uh, video. This is a what is it like a hologram? Like a hologram. Yeah. 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 It's deep fake. fake. It's deep yeah, fake. Yeah. Deep fake. <laughs> I don't know why you had to put uh, so much gray yeah. in my deep it's, fake beard, but yeah, it's AI it generated. Is. Right. Yeah. We gotta make it look realistic, you know. I guess that's true. So, um, yeah. Can you deep fake uh, me some hair? A couple of yeah. <laughs> <laughs> some on top, maybe. We don't have the technology for that yet. Uh, it's kind Damn of advanced. It. Um, I want to thank everybody okay. that's hanging out with us today. Uh, this is uh, this is the uh, stream where uh, my PTSD comes back, and we get to learn some things. Hopefully, you guys can glean some information from this. Uh, Bill and I are, uh, I guess, our former police officers. We, uh, we did yes. some time in 2017 to 2021 in a pretty big city here in Texas. <laughs> you did, and time. so yeah. we did our time. Yes, <laughs> it, it feels like college to me now. I'm far enough away from it where it's like I did a thing yeah. for a bunch of years and we, I got something we, out of it. Kind of, we gained an education yeah. from it. There it is. There it is. Yeah. So, uh, Sergeant George, thank you for being here. He's known it was here the school as, of hard knocks. Yeah, <laughs> he's known here as hmm. Saint George. I Streets do have university. I back. do have my Bible. Hey, Josh, I want you to say Peter's last name. I'm ready. Hold on. Oh, right Peter Cora uh, Cora Codimus. It's pretty good. He added like three letters in there. Coro. Oh, Coro Demus. Sound it out. Coro Demus. How would you say that? I don't know. That's why I asked. Give you. me the phonetics, Peter. Good to see you, Peter. <laughs> Peter um, Coro Demus. I feel like that's Greek. <laughs> I don't know why. Peter. Daniel, it's good to see you. Peta. 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 Uh, Peta. Dylan, it is also good to see Peta. you. Panzer's here to make sad tank noises. Peta. Alfredo's here again. It's good to see Alfredo. Um, Dr. Jute June. Uh, hi, I just saw you like five seconds ago. Uh, he was in our Discord. Uh, Warriors here. We will play some of your uh, videos, I'm sure. Maybe. Um, Depends on if you ask the right person in the Discord. That is very true. That is 100% <laughs> true. Also, let's just get this out of the way. Uh, don't send me your dogs getting killed videos. I'm not going to play them. <laughs> he will so. not play them and you will get him. I'm back. just telling you right now, I'm not going to play them. So, um, let's see. What do we have here? Brian P is also here. And... Oh, Chris Kaufman's here. What's going on, my dude? Um, Chris, you got it on the last one. Oh, it looked like that. Good job. Peter. We got his, I'm, you're going to go by Peter here. Cause I'm not about to try that one. <laughs> what? PK. We'll call you PK. <laughs> yeah, PK. <laughs> Uh, so anyways, it is good to see you. Yeah, I appreciate it. You could, uh, drop <laughs> <a> <laughs> you could drop a like. I'd also like to thank our Discord group. Uh, is it 65 people now? It's pretty. Discord? It's up there, yeah. Like it's a lot. Anyways, 67, something um, like that. You guys make these things uh, possible. I really do appreciate it. If you guys would like access to that, it is a uh, as little as a dollar a month that gives you access to our Discord. And we hang out and play games and have discussions. It is where the after party will happen tonight. Uh, so go check that stuff out. Uh, Patreon slash only cops or whatever it is. And if you wait, where's my patch? At the $5 and up tier, you can get a, you cool get a patch. patch. And then at like, or, like 15 or, bucks, you start getting merch and stuff. Can contribute to this channel from its inception and maybe get it. <laughs> Still don't have mine. Yeah. Yeah. That's Bill. So... Uh, I, have, I have two, Bill. I'll just give you one. <laughs> I, well... Kill kind of actually no. Let's make Josh do. Doesn't it. Josh have like forty of them? I've got like seventy of them left. Yes, yeah, I have a bunch. Uh, I gotta mail some out still. Uh, I have one. I know that's going to Australia, and I think one that's going to Canada. I need to go mail these things. Canada out. I have addresses, and Yikes. I need to mail these things out. That is on me. Back around at the border. The buck stops at me on those. But 
Uh, I want to say hello to everybody that's here. Um, and then uh, we're going to get started if that's cool with y'all. Uh, this no. is, um, if you guys have any questions that are law enforcement related or otherwise, go ahead and put them in the chat. Go ahead and drop a like so people can go watch this stuff and get hopefully educated. YouTube, the purpose of this is to, for educational purposes, we're trying to both inform uh, prospecting police officers, maybe current police officers, and then civilian uh, eyes as to why things happen here and how they can possibly be done better. Yes, this is a bit of armchair quarterbacking, but it's important to have these discussions so that we can better the world. So, viewer discretion advised. This yes. is all for educational purposes. Um, we don't promote violence unless it's towards the government. So, <laughs> let's get started. Uh, shout out to this classic Ford. Yeah, dude. Continuing on north this is like five generations Jenner. back. That's why oh, I'm shout out to this there. neighborhood. Yeah. Yikes. All these wood sided homes. Some of them. Aaron, second. Aaron, second. Call it the future investor special. Bro, look at that. He actually street. cleared that stop sign. Oof. Yeah, rip everyone's uh, rear view mirrors Sorry, here. You want me to leave here? My, uh, the beginning of my yeah, right. coolest, longest. Basically, only pursuit started on the street that was that congested. Just this wide, yeah. Dude, horrible. It was horrible. Uh, this, this program is, is rated X. I don't know about that. All right, let's calm down. It's extra long, <laughs> dude. Yeah, single cab, eight-foot bed, yeah, and dude. it's red. Bro, Ooh. drive better. Get on, it. Get on it. He's doing a good job calling it out, though. It's also a crappy street. He did clear yeah. that stop sign. Shout out to him. Ooh. Bro, he's crushing it. Orientation. Yeah. Everything. This is how they teach it. He should have a second unit to him, but I bet you he's a county guy. I was going to say, it doesn't look like a huge town, so he's like probably a county. a county guy just working like a small city or something like that. Yeah. Oh, that's cloud. That car's like, I'm getting out of here. <laughs> okay, he's got a second unit now. Ooh. Oh, okay, okay. Damn. Out. Yeah, he's yeah. gonna run. Let's say he runs. Let's see it. Run, 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 run. Not gonna let him. Oh, no. oh, he's trying on the other side. I saw the door. Oh, we don't get apprehension. Oh, that's lame. Wow. My bad. Aww. Um, I do like the idea of pinning the door shut because you can handle them in there and then figure out yeah. what it is and then get them to come out. Um, what you don't want, uh, almost as dangerous as vehicle pursuits are foot pursuits because your, um, decision-making time is shrunk a lot, especially when you talk about lethal force and then, um, also controlling where they go. They can get into a mm -hmm. lot more stuff like private property. Or like that so, video we watched last week where he just runs in the highway and gets splattered. Yeah, exactly. Dude, so that was... try to keep it. Yeah. If it's, if it's going to be in the vehicle, try to apprehend him there. And then, um, he did a good job. I mean, there was a few times where it got a little squirrely, but a lot of people underappreciate how hard it is to do this well, because you got one hand on your in-car radio. You're driving with the other, and while you're driving, you're like trying to call, especially if you're getting into unknown places, you're like reading street signs at 90 yeah. miles per hour. It's it, This is probably up there with one of the more difficult things, tasks, like multitasking. So I feel like I was lucky because I'm normally like a one-handed driver, not because yes. I'm doing Doesn't anything with my other hand, yeah. but I'm just so yeah. comfortable driving with one hand Yeah, that I'll just switch off. So I feel like... That helped me a lot, especially in you're, driving. And you're pretty much, course. If, especially if you're doing interdiction at all, like, dude, you're typing in, like, license plates, yeah, license every plates and stuff like that. Like, you're, 10 you're seconds, probably. Yeah. And in this instance, I, I, I'm, you have an in car radio typically versus your portable, which stays in your body. Yeah. Um, so, would it be helpful to, like, have a second person in the car with you that could do a lot of that stuff? While no, that seems out? pointless, yeah, know. right? No. Yeah, that seems no. stupid. That wow. seems really, really silly. Really stupid and yeah. dumb. Yeah. Yeah. Tradition. Yeah. yeah. Stupid Gen Z. They don't know what really they're talking about. Officer <laughs> presence, I guess, you know? Okay. My bad. That... I'm, I'm dumb. I'm not, I was never a cop, so I wouldn't know. I wouldn't know it would be good ideas, you know? Uh, Jay Maxi, it's good to see you, you old crusty bastard. I love you. Um, yeah, so you're going to love this one, Josh. I've already watched it just to get a real feel of what was going on here. 
Wow, it's that guy incredible. was blowing by him. Yeah. That guy in pursuit? No. He's not, because his lights weren't on. This guy's just trying to figure out what I... He's going fast. Pam's here. Pam! Got it. Oh, I... Hell, that guy's driving this fast. No oh. way. Oh, just wait. It gets so much better. Down that bumper, no? Oh, is this the I, I think I know this one. Oh, I'm sure you've seen it. It's been all yes. over Instagram today. Yeah. yeah. Is he not stopping? Nope. And does he not know that this is for him? He does. <laughs> He's like, who are we chasing? You're going to cut him off? Yep. You going to pull over? And I'm in there. Pull over. Yeah, dog. Do that shit in my city? Yeah, I'd be mad too. I'd be super mad. 3113 to 313. What? Do you... I am going into work. Don't give me man. attitude, Why dog. are you trying to pull me over as I'm going to work? Because you're going 80 and a 45. I am going into work. Okay, where are you going to work like Doesn't I'm matter. dressed for? I don't know I why they blurred his like face. My name is Deputy Hilton, and they see your driver's license. No. Okay. Okay. You can literally see his no, name. he's going to refuse? Not just refuse. He's out. He refused? He's leaving. Orlando. Yeah, he's going to flee? City, uh, he's leaving. Orlando PD taking off from the energy. traffic stop. Okay. Uh, it's going to be X-Ray Fox Rod 6207, XF 6207. Pause it real quick. Refuse Hang on, it's almost uh, over. Okay. Yeah. Oh, we don't get to see the disposition here? He gets fired. Oh, good. Yeah. Like, so, like I, very quickly, I, he gets fired. And there's a pending criminal investigation, yeah. too. I read I, it. I mean, like, says, yeah. So if if this guy was going code to a call, because let's say he's on call, right? Because you have on call SWAT. Like, our SWAT officers had to live within a certain distance of the city. They had take home calls, cars. And if a something popped off and we needed a SWAT response, they were going lights and sirens, right? So, red flag number one is you're not running with lights and sirens, right? If you're running lights and sirens, the first thing another cop's going to say when they see this, uh, one of the shootings I, I reacted to, it was just that. I just saw lights going, recognized units, and I was like, I guess show me following wherever the hell they're going because I'm not doing anything. Yeah. Um, emergency, most state code in Texas, the code's going to say under the provision of an emergency need. So there's an exigent circumstance that requires that you're using your emergency vehicle, which is a marked car with the lights and sirens. That is to do that. In, a, in no other instance are you allowed to use or operate the vehicle in that manner. If you're not doing that, then traffic code still applies to you just like it would everybody else. Um, not gonna lie, it would have made my day if he went hands-on with the guy. <laughs> um, didn't even have a chance. Fortunately, this officer learned um, the hard way uh, that that's the case, and that's why he's no longer a cop. It's good. So he was charged with resisting an officer, reckless driving, fleeing and eluding. He turned himself in on Friday to the county. He was released on a $9,000 bond. So Wow. What an idiot. Um, and he was relieved from duty. And he's, I mean, obviously, there's still an IA sure. investigation, but it ain't going to... I mean, that's, that's he's been criminally charged, so there's not much to investigate. So. Yeah. Well, and I prefer this because it's going to prevent him from going somewhere else and trying to be a cop. Like, you just, there's no need. There's no need for that bullshit. That's yeah, because, so like, stupid. even if he was fired, you know some agency would take him. Sure. But you don't have to pay for the, for the training. You don't but have to do all that other kind charges? of stuff. But charges? Yeah. No. No one's going to touch Won't him with a 10 foot pole, and it's the way it should be. Won't because if you're him. late to work, go be late to work. Tell somebody mm -hmm. and don't I do whatever. It all the time. Don't be driving like an asshole. So. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I make my own schedule. I'm still late. Yeah, well. Just it's live fine. with it. <laughs> it's you're, on, uh, you're on Josh time, right? Yes. Exactly, yeah. yeah D minus for cuffing. <laughs> oh, my God. Yes, I would have liked to see him. Howard, Howard Houston Police Department. 
Maybe we'll get the like the in jail video when he turned himself in. Oh, what's going on? I bet we could find it. You are about to see video footage. Especially since they didn't show his face in the damn video. I know. HPD conducts thorough investigations into officer-involved shootings. These typically require investigators to interview multiple witnesses, view numerous hours of video footage, and analyze. Yeah, we're playing. Is he going to speak for his people? Yeah. It is important to note that we are in the very early stages. Andromeda, said, Andromeda what's going on? Interesting and looking chief. Yeah, well. This is also is going to be a deputy analyzed. chief. The videos you are about to see can be like graphic and may be difficult maybe. to watch. These videos may also Isn't contain the strong language. He's got better things to do, advised. like sit at his desk. I approve their little studio setup, though. They did a good job yeah. with the lighting they did and the backdrop yeah. and everything. Yeah. We've seen some jank ones. At approximately 1.30 p.m., Houston police <laughs> And mad responded respect to for, like, discharging angling the light to where it's not reflecting on the glasses. Yeah. It's, it's backlit, drive. too. <laughs> yeah, it is. It is. They got the, yeah, they got the hair line like I got back here. I can't Christian Halsey! Open I got enough space. Front door and fired a Thank you for monetizing the, the unmonetizable stream. That officer discharged his duty weapon and retreated Also, they have a teleprompter, you can tell, because the officer Mr. Lopez exited the apartment like, with a gun in hand. I'm not mad about that. It's a lot of information. I think when she looks oh, yeah, up, no, you can so kind of see it. Taken into custody yeah. Without further well, or maybe I'm that's the light. Of that because it's but better than one of the officers having to do yes. a billion takes. Yes. yes. Weapon, mm -hmm. And she's got she's practicing. It's not easy to keep up with a teleprompter. Ten, yo. <laughs> you are too much. I'm giving props. Yeah, it was pretty good. Pretty good talking out of a police officer. I hate, hate, hate these apartment complexes. Oh, look at the security gate. Yeah. Oh, shit. Oh. <laughs> Going to get. Hello. Oh, oh shit. Jeez. Shot fired. Shot fired. Yeah, no, no kidding. Shout out to being a lefty. Shout out to Mother. Yeah, he had no time on that. I wonder if he's actually a lefty, or if he oh, was. Oh, he cross through that. Did he had his. Uh, he had his flashlight. I think he had a baton oh, in his hand. Yeah. So. Baton, yeah. I don't know, dude. Wow, that is. You might have to rewatch uh, the is that a handheld radio? Where's this guy going? Oh, he's maybe trying to make sure this guy can't run or what? We get another body cam view here in just a second. That's him. On the ground, on the ground. There you go. On the ground. Well, he must be a lefty. On the ground. He's a lefty, yeah. Sure. yeah. On the ground. He said I'm the one that called 911. Damn. On the ground. That's close to the ground as you're going to get. He missed? Probably. Yeah, he doesn't look like he's leaking. <laughs> Pretty good cuffing. I was very good. I'll give him an A plus on the I cuffing. I got Grace. You got Grace? Yeah. Did he get shot? I don't think so. No, so the guy, yeah. The officer said he might have got a Grace, but the, the guy himself didn't get shot. He said, you almost shot me. Oh, I'm saying, I wonder if the suspect discharged his firearm. Oh yeah, I don't know. I don't know. We might we might frame by frame it. I'd just be curious. Yeah, I'd I'd like to see what the heck because that was super quick. You'll see it here. He's working. Ooh. Oh, the stairs the cover stairs it. Were blocking everything. We might have to go back to the beginning. Came to the door. Came to the door. Fucking. There's the. Chris Special with the radio in his hand. Yeah. Play it down, slow down the playback. Do uh, or just, I guess, you can use the directional. Yeah, use the period. And the comma should. <laughs> what is it? Hello? Pause. Oh, oh he dude, he leveled, he, he leveled the gun, yeah. He 100% So it's a uh, comma and period is how you go frame by frame. There it goes, yeah. Oh. Dude, I wonder if he cranked one off. He just. Damn. Oh yeah, he might have. Hang on. There's go forward like three frames. 
he might have cranked. I one saw off. like a little that red like dot that might have been yeah. a bit of muzzle flash. I tell you what, old boy here is in it to win it. That's as much as you could ask out of that position. And this is why you don't stand directly in front of the door. This bought him time to kind of see yeah. it happen. Shit. Uh, I tell you what, as a backup officer, there wasn't much you could have done. And no. that's why I don't like these apartments is where does the backup officer stand? They just get the hell mm -hmm. out of the way. Uh, and they can go recover your body if you get shot at. Damn. Anybody get hurt? It no. doesn't say. That's I don't like know. the tell you what, shittiest though, was... description I've ever seen. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> uh, that was an okay corral. I, I do like that he was at least, that's as best as you can do in that situation. But a lot of times, uh, we, we're back to Houston. Look at that. Yeah. Um, when you're stuck in those situations, you just kind of got to make the best out of it. It's the one thing that, that a lot of people don't appreciate about having to go and make contact like that is you're always in a tactically stupid position. <laughs> on, on Martin Luther King Boulevard. Yeah. This is a meme already. <laughs> oh, I'm hey. Her reading compared to the last. Time. Uh, remember that city we used to work for? Yeah. They renamed one of their streets. Martin Stop. Luther. Yeah. Which one? Center. Why did the crime go up there? Or what? Center. Yeah. Center's going. No. Up there. That's. Yeah. Damn. <laughs> yeah. Wait, it was Lincoln. Didn't it change into Lincoln once you got north of Lamar? No, no. Center on South Side. Oh, uh, I wonder if all. it's a shitty. So it goes from being the center street to Lincoln, and the second it hit Lincoln, it got terrible. So, what's, so I wonder what's if funny, it's the same on South Side. What's funny is on South Side, center street is like a quarter mile at best. Oh, really? It's hardly a street. Like, it literally takes you from Barden north to, I think... Um, this Arkansas, again. maybe. Oh, that's maybe. that's like uh, bro. That's it's like nothing. A blocks. It's yeah. nothing. Like it has to be the shortest street on South Side, <laughs> and they changed the name. So I was like, well, of all the streets, I guess. I guess, dog. Yeah. Yeah. Arlington's department. <laughs> this critical incident Malcolm briefing X. was intended to provide you with information Chris. about an officer-involved shooting that occurred in Houston on April 11th, 2023. You are about to see video footage I'm judging that this is related chick compared to, this to the previous deputy chief. HPD uh, conducts thorough investigations job. into officer yeah. involved shootings. These typically require investigators to Their assistant chief sergeant George. Yeah. numerous hours yeah. of video footage. Yeah, at least ACs or, or DCs. That's what it's it said assistant chief. It's important okay. To note that we are in the very early stages of the investigation and we continue to review additional evidence. Tell you what I'm not a fan of their badges. Analyzed. The I'm not a fan of any part of their uniform. May be difficult to yeah. watch. These videos may also contain strong language. Viewer discretion is advised. <clears throat> yeah. Viewer discretion is advised. What she said. Hey, advised. Mr. Toastar, what's going on, homie? At 2:29 p.m., a Houston police officer oh, and retro's here. A stolen Honda in a parking Dylan lot gets at it. 12,375 <laughs> Martin Luther King Boulevard. The officer activated his emergency yep. lights and the heights. <laughs> unit yep. directly behind the Honda. Jamar Vantrell Thompson. More medals equals better chief. Yeah. That's how it Thompson works in the military to too, right? Car. Mm -hmm. Mr. Thompson refused, placed the Honda in reverse, and rammed the police vehicle. Oh, that's a good way to Mr. get Thompson hurt. Mr. Thompson then exited the vehicle. And I'm going to find my Legos and then I'm going to make a little block. Just you should. To my shirt you should. Stream. It'd be worth more than Mr. those uh, ribbons on her chest. On she, hey, we yeah. don't know yeah. that. We don't know that. Maybe yeah, she was awesome. I'll wear that on one side and then my little sheriff badge on the other side. The likelihood's low. I don't know what those mean, but I bet she just got them for time in the department. I don't know. Technically, the technically, I could have had like six on my chest if I wanted for like fitness tests and all that shit. Like, yeah, all the random stuff. Yeah, so. <laughs> Accomplished I don't, traffic stop. I don't. Uh, They're like achievements in a video game. Yeah, I don't buy into yeah. it much. Like finish the tutorial, you get one. I mean, we had a classmate slash shift mate that wore a purple heart for getting hit by a car. So. Or he rolled up on him heavy. That's a sweet pistol. Yeah, 
Stop. Stop. Hi. Stop. 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 Why are you? What are you doing? Stop. Did you get for helping? They're close. Oh, she's help. Bro, he's very lucky she's not assaulted. This is. It's a mic loop. Mm. What was the stop for? I'm sure we talked over the AC yeah. about this. What up, Keith? Oh, what's he Give me the taser. She has his taser in in her hand. Yeah, she does. She's like holding it for him, I guess. This is Mount Survival now, dog. What? His belt? Oh, he pulled his gun up. Yeah. He's gonna go well. Bro, that was. I don't know, man. Don't move. Don't move. I don't need to listen to this lady yell. Um, are there other officers now? Yeah, that's my guess, yeah. Yeah, because he's just very calmly walking away. I wonder what the contact is for. What is going on? It's not terribly helpful. Thank you for that. I don't know, man. That's going to be a little on the... So... So... I mean, he opened the car door with his gun drawn, so I'm wondering what the... That's what I'm saying. I wonder what the contact was for. Ooh. Yeah. That don't look great. He's leaking. I got one. He's unconscious. He does have a pulse. He is breathing. Uh, is he? Looks like shoulder. Somebody needs to get this lady. I think he's still by himself. Is he? It looks like he's still by himself. How can you be in Houston? I'm going to need units? Wow. He's just now asking for units? How are you going to be in Houston and be by yourself this long? There's no way, dude. Especially if it's HPD. Video description doesn't like... say a damn thing. Uh, yeah, I figure their descriptions yeah. suck. Yeah, I'm, I'm on the Houston Police Department website. It's uh, 4 11 One, if you want to look up the date. Which yeah, I have, it, I have it pulled up. And it's just that it takes him like halfway into the article to tell me what happened. Can't believe he died that fast from a shoulder gunshot. I mean, it depends on what angle it went in, though, right? Sure. Yeah. I mean, maybe, but I mean, all the blood's in, up here. If it, if it, goes if it like went this, in sideways, if it, goes like... if it went through his thoracic, yeah, he's a goner. Mm -hmm. That's just a shoulder wound. It, uh, that's what I'm saying. It just looks like a. And you could have TQ'd it. It wouldn't it's have done great. It's pretty high. No, but I'm just saying, just to even just apply pressure. Yeah. But he's not bleeding that much. I think so he's... A stolen vehicle was what it was for. Oh. He said he... Why are you approaching huh? a stolen vehicle by yourself? Okay. To be yeah. in, a, in Houston is what I'm getting at. So, so like, if this guy's in county, I understand it a bit more. Okay, pause it. Free advice. You do not give CPR to someone who's bleeding to death, okay? You give CPR to people that are unconscious and don't have a pulse. They don't have a pulse because they're not, because they bled out. That's a whole different ball. I'm game. just, I'm, I'm, there was not that weird. much blood. Yeah. Unless it, like, I don't, shit, I don't know. That's a weird deal. Unless his chest cavity is full of blood and we just don't see it. Don't see it. Could have also had a comorbidity. Is like he seemed kind of high, like he seemed impaired uh, when he was first interacting with him. And the, the the clue I'm looking for here is, and this can also happen from stress. 
where you'll have people just start repeating in this like negative feedback loop where they just keep saying the same thing no matter what you do. Yeah. But it was odd. His cadence of speech didn't make a lot of sense. But also, like, it's a big reason why we don't try to apprehend people by them by yourself. Um, yeah, at so, least have time to do. So they're asking for a chest seal. Yeah, this says that he was pronounced dead at the hospital. Mm. Um, so he said it gave him medical assistance until paramedics arrived, and then he was transported to an area hospital where he was pronounced deceased. So would they pronounce him deceased at the hospital either way, or like? I mean, yeah. He so or... I guess if EMS didn't want to call it, mm -hmm. but well, I would assume would call it. I would assume in an OIS they're going to work on the victim until yeah. they get to the hospital, just to make sure that they did everything they could. Look at Pam. So hit that break brachial artery. Look at that coming in there with straight oh, facts. Okay, yeah. I mean, I, but where's the blood? That's I'm kind of with that, but also where's the blood? Unless yeah. it's seeping into his chest cavity. But then how did uh, like how did you know it get what? there? You'd have a big old bruise on your chest from you know what I mean. If the if the artery retracted, because it's like and went into like his chest, you know. But look at where the it's like here it's like here anyways either way i had to i'm not a medical professional but i've seen a lot of traumatic injuries and this is kind of a weird one that being said i just think if you're gonna go and engage with a stolen car this is why high-risk takedowns are a thing where you're not approaching the vehicle you're waiting for a second or you're waiting for a third or you try to call and again angry cops made fun of us for this and <laughs> that you know why are you handling a high-risk takedown it minimizes danger to the officer right Obviously, the guy went and rammed the car uh, in that instance. Like, good luck. This The only reason why he was able to get this guy out of the car was because the guy left the car. Yeah. He was fully seat belted in. You're, you're going to be very hard pressed to reach across this guy, undo the seat belt, yeah. and then pull him out by yourself at least. Yeah. The other problem is, like, let's say you use a knife to cut him or let's say you have a seat belt cutter or something like that with a glass breaker. Even that, I, I from a tactic standpoint, he gets like a negative 50 because I would have at least wanted a second unit there on a felony takedown of a car, right? And then, like, he didn't even get on the radio until after he smoked the guy and was working yeah. on him. Yeah. Like, in Houston, if there's yeah. help that can be had, and clearly there's officers here, I don't. We're, we're Monday morning quarterbacking the hell out of it. But, like, just free advice if you're going to get into something spicy, go ahead and get a second at least it also there's, there's, there's no button. uh there's no blood on the ground so yeah, i wonder if the dude weird. was already on the ground or like kneeling know, dude. and he know, shot dude. him and it went in like yeah. in this way that would make a lot more sense to me how he died that fast that was my thought as well because i feel like the angle must have had it had to have been this way otherwise i mean there's no exit wound like i don't know where yeah i just slowed it down on the back there's no blood on the ground there's just yeah. blood here so yep. it probably went it this way mm -hmm. and just destroyed everything inside. Yep. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. I feel like this is another one of those where like bad tactics lead to a justified shooting, basically. I don't know yeah. if this is justified. <laughs> so the problem uh, is, yeah. and, and, and I can I say don't this know. from experience. So when we did use of force tactics, when we were first learning how to do uh, fight sims, this wasn't even a fight sim. This was just practice. I got, uh, I, I was fighting a guy that's way better at fighting than I am, right? And the fight had taken so long. I just said, fuck it. I'm just smoked. It. And it's in training, right? Mm -hmm. And so I go and smoke the guy and I had to answer lectures. He's, well, why'd you shoot the guy? And I was like, I'm having a hard time breathing at this point And I don't think I'm going to win this fight. The, the scenario was like he was cutting himself or he had been cutting himself. So he's bleeding. And he has, uh, I think he had AIDS or something like that. But in the scenario, right? Yeah. And so he's bleeding all over me. There's all this kind of stuff. And yes, technically, like bodily fluid can be considered aggravated assault. But A, I was uh, in the academy. I couldn't articulate the use of force. But also, they gave me a hard lecture. And it's like, hey, losing a fight is not going to justify lethal force. So and my thing is, yeah. we didn't get to see it very well because his body camera fell off. But it sure I seemed like the dude got up and got off of him. Right? Yeah. 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 So well, that's the thing is like without yeah without seeing that part I was just kind of getting So it, if the out. guy got up but, and off of him how are you justifying the shooting? I, that's kind of what mm -hmm. I'm getting at is it it's a weird my only thought was the grabbing of at the belt potentially because sure, sure. the guy was grabbing at his belt and also the other lady having the taser 
Um, or maybe if you didn't know where your taser was, you just knew you didn't have it. He knew that she it. had it because he okay. said, give me the taser, give me the taser. Mm -hmm. And while yeah. he was distracted by trying to get his taser back from her, that's when the dude mm -hmm. flipped him and mm -hmm. got on top. But then it looked like he was off of the cop. Yeah. So it's and like, I, I, and I guarantee you that unless uh, he took the taser and he was like pointing it at the cop. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I mean, you're gonna be justified there. It's just like, are you though? Because yeah. uh, well, old boy and, in and, Michigan got charged with murder. So well, and, mm -hmm. and kind of what I'm getting at is you're still opening yourself up from a liability standpoint. They're gonna say, well, what is what are what are SOPs, right? This is how yeah. this conversation is gonna play out in the court of law. What are SOPs for a, a felony takedown of a vehicle? I tell you right now, it's in Texas. It's going to be have as many units as you can get available. And in Houston, they probably have like 9,000 cops currently on duty, right? I don't know. Just like, I don't know. Just think before you do stuff. Um, Pam, thank you for the super chat. Uh, we do not deserve you. Um, and we love you. Thank you for monetizing the often unmonetizable stream. So... Give me the taser. Yeah, that was the part where it, no, but he well, and he's, really like, he's just trying to push him, like him off. Pushing, yeah. 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 yeah, yeah. On the yeah. first watch, I thought he was like grabbing his stuff, but he's really not. So he called out his location there. Yeah. So guys, up. He's up. Okay, yeah, he's, he's like gone, and then he just drew. I don't know, then, dude. So I, I kind of get. I think what might have happened is so he gets put on his back. He's got somebody on top of him, and this other lady that he doesn't know what's going on. She's like it. standing over him. Agreed. And and she but again. He didn't look like he was not, on him, but it's hard yeah. to see because the body cam's on the ground. So. When you're not, dude, is this an O light? Oh, big sin. I see the magnetic charger. This is an O light. Oof. Um, sorry, I got distracted. Definitely not justified then. Uh, no, no. What I'm getting <laughs> at is in jail. What I'm getting <laughs> at is right now. So you're in a fight, right? You have the second person, which I even said he's very lucky that this person was not combative. Um, the lady, regardless of what her real intentions were, because we can't know, um, on camera she does not look combative, right? No. Um, mm -hmm. and so I think maybe psychologically for him, when he rolls on his back, he's got a guy that's on top of him, well, and then another person that he thinks he's now but in a two on one fight, and that's maybe how he. To be fair, things. she it didn't look like she had the taser in her hand, so he may Agreed. have picked it up. It's a it's. So. I wouldn't want to be in this OIS. No. I'll tell you that right now. I would not have. Nope. Wanted any part of that, but. So that sucks. Yeah. That's a dumb thing to die over, but also. Yeah. Don't fight like, with the cops. Like, but I'm also wondering, was that lady even? Because I don't think she, she. I think she was just in the parking lot. With, no, I think that was his girlfriend. Was it okay? The way she was talking. None of the articles mentioned to him her, or about him like, or, at all, really. Unless she was just that. I don't know. Seemed like it was his girlfriend because he was calling her baby. He said, "Baby, get oh, okay. him off me." Yeah, I think they knew each other. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Did she again acquaintances? <laughs> Optically, it looked like she was trying to help, but like my free advice is to not. She was can, not. But, I wouldn't yeah. say she was. Uh, oh, here we go. She was interfering a little bit, but yeah, they call her female acquaintance. Yeah, there it is, female acquaintance on Fox Twenty Six. Uh, okay. I've I've participated in this. Put your hands on top of your head. Except Easy. this is Do it now. tonight an active shooter drill. This is uh, a little different. Keep the line open. Oh, it's like your UFO story. Police, yeah. patients, yeah. and some employees <laughs> thought there was an active shooter at a Michigan Children's Psychiatric Hospital That's hilarious. Y'all can't do anything but right up there in Michigan. it was just a drill. And now a state investigation <laughs> is underway. Y'all can't do a damn thing right. What went wrong? Where are you in the building? I don't know, please. In the 911 call audio obtained by NBC affiliate WDIV, you can hear the panic in the voices of callers inside the Hawthorne Center in Northville, Michigan. Ma'am, you still there? No idea where that is. Hello? Hi. Just want to make sure you're still there. I believe you're in the building. Police yes. Saying they yes, also they are. Had not been warned oh, I gotta tell you what. Exercise. Oh my God. Quickly upon our arrival, For people idiots. were stating that they were. I ain't even mad at the cops. A drill. To identify that this is a drill because you literally have every jurisdiction. If you look around, there's probably 50 I, cop cars 100%, out here. 100. When I heard those sirens, I'm like, oh. Yeah. Well, we're coming. We're coming hot, man. They 
did the unfortunate mistake of doing it unannounced, and we don't want that to ever be the case. A law enforcement analyst <laughs> we spoke with agrees. I wonder who so was... Oh, I know where Livonia is. An active I wonder scenario <laughs> who was doing the training, what facility, department. And this is the psychiatric facility with uh, employees and, and patients who were not prepared to this so like do you not have to just like isn't it like just an empty building that you would do this in what no 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 so which operates the facility provided a statement to wdiv saying in part quote md hhs is investigating the events involved in the recent drill conducted at hawthorne center to ensure these policies are followed for any future drills a vital step to prevent future incidents, but impossible to turn back time for the people inside the center who were clearly traumatized by the botched exercise. Okay, so I just got. Bunch uh, of them probably how would you not PTSD. think that like a drill, you can leave your office? Okay? Maybe I should explain this. Okay, what? you did you did fine. Okay, I'm like, sorry. oh, we're doing a drill at a hospital Steven that's Rowe like active. Like, I mean. At least right, tell the building. I don't care about the news. But. So um, I did shout out to Blue Bearing that the episode for this is coming <sighs> out. But we Man. did a drill in an elementary school. It was on a Sunday, which helped, right? But it was in the middle of a neighborhood. So yeah. we had to, we A, had local PD there with us. Uh, we had signs all over the, like every street leading up to it, we had signs saying, hey, there's a police training event occurring. <laughs> Dispatch knew. And we still had, because there's people like walking their kids. It's like a neighborhood around us, right? Oh, my God. That all they see is a bunch of dudes running with guns in their hands. And they still had yelling. police show up. <laughs> yeah, yelling, literally yelling. Um, and there's actors that are yelling and all this kind of stuff. And so we still kids had Kids screaming. Calls. I'm yeah. dying. And since there was a, yeah, since there was a 911 call, police still came out. But they like were told by dispatch there should be a drill going on here. An officer still showed up. They were like, ah, oh, this is awesome. Why am I not getting to do this? I'm at work. But like, there was like three layers of notifications. They even knew yeah. what times we were doing it at. Like, it's just so stupid. That's yeah. the dumbest. That's your guys are idiots. Shout out to Blue Bearing. They're, good. They're really good dudes out there. <sighs> what a time. Mm -hmm. Hello. I'm Sergeant Rob Shear with the Phoenix. Oh, well, they have Department sergeants doing Affairs this in Bureau. Phoenix. My guy. Information, audio video and pictures you are about to see are intended to provide details mm. as we currently understand them of an officer. I really hate when cops on May 22nd, like wear their, this video I, I get, assume that's his class, class A's, A's without a vest. A's, which I, I think it's stupid. Wear a vest. You were <laughs> if you got a police uniform on, you it would make you look so much better than the sloppy mess that you look like in this video. Refused to stop yeah. during a lawful traffic stop. This incident originally began in the area of 35th Avenue and Glendale Avenue when Phoenix police. Also, tell me you work at a desk without telling me you work at a desk. <laughs> of is that beard supposed to be a beard? Or is that just like I forgot Here's to shave today? Phoenix 911, yeah. where's your emergency? I'm not a. Shout out to the directions. Out in it. I'm the DWI, you ho! With, like, not with Sure is. Body worn cameras are used by all officers. Mad. Oh, here it is. The Axon commercial. Skip the Axon commercial. Initially, the woman was not responsive, but appeared to wake up as officers were in the parking lot. She was given commands to put the vehicle in park. She did not comply and instead oh. drove out of the parking lot. Here is the body worn camera footage from one of the officers who made the initial contact with the woman. Have fun with this, Dewey. <laughs> Sergeant George said yay for sergeants. It's got Dewey written all over it. Ah, put it in park. Put it in Looks like a goatee. Yeah. <laughs> hey. Oh, look at the puppers. Hey, oh, no. The puppers have hey. nothing to do with this. Say police. We get a minus five for not saying police. Yeah. Some lawyer somewhere is like, there's reasonable doubt. Officers followed the vehicle and attempted to make a traffic stop. The vehicle pulled over in a nearby apartment complex. The driver was given Home multiple safe. commands to turn the vehicle off and throw the keys out of the car. The woman did not comply with any of these commands and again took off from officers. Here is body-worn camera footage from the traffic stop. They got air one already? You hear the helicopter? It's Phoenix, bro. They don't fuck around. They don't fuck around, yeah. 
Look at her viciously taken off in this uh, <laughs> Ultima. <laughs> The Phoenix police helicopter was overhead. Cody, what's going on, my dude? 15 minutes until it was in the area of 19th Avenue and Phelps Drive. This is where officers with the Tactical Support Bureau immobilized the vehicle. Once the vehicle was stopped, Be officers positioned themselves around the vehicle. Officers gave multiple commands for the woman to show her hands and turn off the car. The woman did not comply. The woman produced an object perceived to be a handgun. I'll quit if they shoot that dog. Officer. This is when multiple that dog looks pretty docile. I'm probably just gonna hang out. After the shooting, the woman clearly you didn't watch the two videos hands. that they put in the Discord. Comply. Oh, I An did officer that. deployed yeah. two rounds from a 40 millimeter launcher at the driver's window to remove the glass, giving officers a clearer view of the woman. The 40 millimeter launcher is a less lethal. Oh, they got a commercial for this. Damn. Also, they're rocking a hollow sun EPS on that. Let me see your hands. Let me see your hands. Do it now. Do it now. Turn off the car. Turn off the car. Bro, crossfire much, dog. Also, not an appropriate time to deploy a dog. Not unless you want it to get run over. Or we're just donating. What is this guy in the background doing? Also, what in Crossfire? Still moving. Show me your fucking hands! Show me your hands! Can you see that gun? You can... Everybody can move, and you can look from a different window. 37! 37! Get your hands out! Oh, yeah, that car's done. Show me your hands. I got a 40. Another one. Show us your hands. She missed. And another one. I think the window's already broken from the gunshots. So I think it's just going through the broken glass. Here's the body worn camera video. Somebody be brave and just come up there and nail it. It should be noted that the officer's right. body worn camera was not you activated until after the shooting occurred. So this footage does not. You won't have get audio. audio. I get it. Boom. Pinned. That's a write up. Oh, they had a grappler. Dog. That's yeah, cool. that's how they. Uh, oh, shit. It's awfully close to that dog. Bro, Bill was about Here to come unglued. Camera footage from the final Shout out to that dog for getting out of the way, though. Discharges his shotgun. <laughs> Dog, what? <laughs> Bro, I, I'd be hella pissed if this guy cranked off shotgun rounds that far behind me. I'd be super pissed. Since the deployment of the 40 millimeter did not remove the glass, an officer used an OC spray Mark 9 canister to deliver an irritant into the car to coax oh, the woman man. out. For the dog? The OC Sweet. Mark 9 canister is a less lethal tool assigned to patrol supervisors. <sighs> Why to would you OC this bureau. car? OC I'm not entirely sure. That disrupts and disorients the intended target, as well as delivers the fancy, like, image and everything. Here's the body-worn camera footage in. of the OC spray Mark 9 deployment. I'm not entirely sure why you would deploy. Yeah, done some Mark 9 in there. Yep. Why are we deploying spray? Did you just spray a corpse? After the OC spray, Poor dog. officers forced open the driver's door window. The woman got out of the car, through the open window, and was taken into custody. Even during this portion, the woman continued to not be fully compliant. Here is the body-worn camera footage of this portion of the incident. Did she really not die from all that? All of it, all of it. We could have done that first? Window. No Crawl out the window. You can't see, so just make sure you throw you everything in there. Crawl out the window now. Crawl out the window. We will get you medical help. You need to crawl out the window. Keep crawling out. Keep crawling out. Hey, don't run up there. Do not run up there. Crawl out. All the way. Stop reaching and crawl out. Crawl out the window. Start crawling out. Who has gloves? Yeah, no shit you can't see. Why would you OC? She's definitely shot. 
Yeah, the OC deployments was dumb, I think. I'm okay. Yeah. Just eat her out of there, say, dog. Yeah. I was going to say, like, why can't they go hands-on at this point? Did you just have, like, a very sad dog that's in there? I got mm -hmm. OC'd the hell out of him. Get her hand. No Get her hand. Can you imagine how awful OC would be on a dog? That's what oh, I mean. Yeah. I feel like um, like I zero understanding what's happening. Get your arm just, underneath uh, her elbow. Misery. I'll dig it underneath on the street side. There you go. Uh, negative 50 on handcuffing. Officer Tactical nuclear strike. No kidding. Until the Phoenix Fire Department arrived. She was taken to the hospital where she was treated for her injuries. The object believed to be a oh, handgun. Hey, millennial cop. The had was My guy. Dude's, uh, he sends to be a great stuff lighter. on our Instagram all the time. Two officers involved in this incident are assigned to attack the uh, If she can't bureau, drive, each have approximately what makes them years think she can grow? The, the other officer is assigned to the South Mountain Precinct. Dude, if you just magged up that car years. and then you're like, hey, crawl out. Bro, also, like, my dude threw, like, three rounds of buckshot through that. I don't know, man. Just lower your expectations. It's really annoying I, how they post these videos with zero description. No context. Zero like, yeah. um, I will say this. I mean, don't don't run from police. You know what I mean? Um, I'd be. They did find the Hellcat. Little, uh, I guess. Shout out to Springfield. Um, uh, she was armed, so the, the use of force is going to be considered justified in that instance. Uh, if you're going to be a dickhead and run from cops and use force, um, don't have a dog in your car. Uh, that just, being said, the OC is still just so dumb. I, to I, me. What I don't understand is now it's going to be a lot harder to also like for officers to get into the car. Right. If you're going to have to forcibly extract her, you don't want to do it with OC chilling. In the but air. also, I, like, I don't know. Like, who... yes, she did not get out of the car, but you also pinned both of her doors with vehicles. So how, how was she, she, she supposed out? to yeah. get out of the car? Yeah. I guarantee you. I guarantee you. They had stripes on their shirt on their sleeve. So you probably didn't hear it, but the uh, OC fogger is only for supervisors. So that was a supervisor who oh. made that decision Pulled it to out do of that. Shiny new box. Yeah. Totally not surprised. Yeah, we'll keep going. I, so. I found the briefing. Let me see if we get anything else out of it. <laughs> Next, uh, Daniel. <laughs> <laughs> Daniel's done with it. Stupid. Also, uh, shout out to Millennial Cop, my guy. Welcome. Uh, bro, what a sketchy ATM. <laughs> oh, so it wasn't even a gun that she had. It was a butane lighter that resembled a handgun. Oh, it wasn't even a... Wow. That was a lighter? Apparently. Well, well interesting. Uh, I wonder I was, if it was one of those that's like shaped, because I have like, it's yeah, not a lighter, but it's I like a little be, knife that's shaped like a... It's like this big. Yeah. But it I is shaped be, like a gun. I'm, I'm still not mad about the use of force if that's what yeah. she produced. I mean, I mean novelty, it looks like a gun. Yeah. Lighter like or not. ones that'll look like a gun. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not gonna pull it up while I'm in the middle yeah. of that. during a well, police she was pursuit. Very, probably very drunk, so yeah, I'm not making great decisions. What is this guy doing? I don't know. What is this cop doing? He's shining a flashlight at old boy. Stupid Two man unit. Oh, you know okay. they're leaving. Come on now. Shout out to whoever's driving this Mercedes. They're crushing it right now. Suspect pulls a gun on officers. They shoot at this guy. Hmm. Said they saw a gun in the vehicle, but I sure don't know how. With that tent, that's a little weird. Uh. The lights and sirens are going. There it is. Shout out to two man units. Light traffic. We're going yeah. eastbound. Oh, I called it. <laughs> Dude, how loud were lights and sirens under an overpass? Under overpasses. Oh my god. So always... annoying. Yeah. Come on now, get on it. On the Manchester entrance. Oh, this is this is beautiful. That Mercedes is pulling away. <laughs> Dude, the backup guy's like, I'm gonna blind him. Northbound. One ten third passing Florence. 
are we Get doing? It, He's just contributing. Your favorite body cam manufacturer. <laughs> yes, my Bible's ready. More of this nonsense. I think we should need a hit. We should get a job. I believe that. This Mercedes would dust you. This Mercedes would super dust you. Even like a base model V6 Mercedes is probably dusting you in a patrol car. I saw that uh, video of the car getting split in half on Instagram. I don't know if it's on YouTube yet. It was pretty gnarly. You don't get to see the crash, you just see the car after the crash. Oh, okay. But it was like a traffic stop. Dude and his girlfriend pulled the dude out. Girlfriend hops in the driver's seat and takes off. Like full on traffic, like stopped traffic. She flies down the shoulder. And I don't know what happened to cause the crash, but she hits the back of a semi and like mm. it tears her car in half. Like, and she survived. Like, she was alive and talking. And I'll see if I can find it after this. <laughs> Your inner Super Saiyan, Sergeant George. <laughs> that happened to me when I had my old Mazda SUV, but it was a semi that came into my lane. And it just not, not you fleeing from the police? No, I was just chilling. And, uh,. <laughs> The Montreal, what's going on? I do like police activity. We have half of these end up being police activity videos. Typically, like a third of them. I really like that channel. Good stuff. Do they even see this car still? I doubt it. Well, maybe it's way up there. It's one of those, right? So, it's all good. Notice, notice they haven't given their speed and they haven't given their uh, uh, like level of traffic, like traffic density. <laughs> they're trying not to. They're trying not to get terminated on this pursuit. Nitrous needed. Agreed. I don't know. I don't see it on there. I don't know, man. If this department was like family, they would have caught him already. That's all you need. There's no way they see this car still. Oh, wow. Yeah. Oh. Oh, wow. I picked the worst fence. Bro. What the fuck? Location. Oh, wow. Put in park. Here we go. Oh, they had a helicopter. That's why. My guy. Look at him go. One climb, one aim. One climb, one aim. So ah. people have clearly climbed that fence before. That's why they put that chain link in between the iron rods. Bro, what are you reaching for, honey? You're about to die. I'm gonna shoot you. Yep, 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 yep. Oh, there it is. He dies. No, he dies. No, he dies right then and there. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Yep. I mean, what do you want? What do you want? Um, negative five for the crossfire, but what are you gonna do? Yeah. He should have died right then and there. Yep, I agree. Honestly, even just him reaching, you. Temple, I, I had twice in my career had yeah. I been in a situation where I was about to put a gun on a guy's temple because he was yeah. reaching like that. Um, shout out to these guys, they stayed in it. If they had a helicopter, I'm less impressed with them keeping up with the Mercedes. It makes sense. I guess they called out this guy, maybe bailing. Um, man, don't run from cops and especially do not pull guns on cops. That's a bad Oof. that will shorten your life expectancy for sure. Sergeant George, um, I've never been in a helicopter. It'd be in cool. My life. It'd be cool. I it would have been one. cool. I got to talk to the helicopter. <laughs> you did. Uh, that was about I it. Got to bear, I got to bear witness like a loser <laughs> sitting available for calls because I didn't get to be in it. That was cool. <laughs> it was cool. I have regrets. Hmm? So Montreal sent us the, the video link, so I'm going to drop it in the Discord. Oh, based. So but he joined? We'll watch it. Uh, no, he, well, he sent it on Instagram. I'm dropping it in the oh. Discord. 
Okay. Worth it. Yeah. What's it on? I bet that. Uh, it's YouTube. What's the so if, channel? Oh, what do you mean? What channel is it on? Uh, Police Pursuits. Police Sheriff Pursuits, Saul. okay. Mm -hmm. So I just dropped the link in the body cam video link. Oh, I see it. Okay. Step out. Step out. You have a warrant for your arrest. Yep, that's the one I saw. The crash. Yeah, it seemed like it was a long video because even on Instagram, they sped it way, like, way mm -hmm. up. Yeah, he said it's like 46 minutes, so yeah. we'll, we'll just watch the important parts. We've got a lot of cops here. Show me on a signal 13 on 1177 Is this a stolen truck? Mm, he said the guy had warrants. Oh, okay. Yeah. I saw Silverado and I was like, that's like Ooh, the most shit. truck Oof. in America. Hey, clear, clear, clear. All right, all right. What? Oh. Those trucks might be cop cars, like oh. undercovers. Oh, wow. Because there's one behind it and then one next to it. So those might be like unmarked. Hey, you caught that crossfire. I like it. Loud and windy. Sergeant George, I'm with you. You can keep me on the ground. Bro, it's consent. There it is. That's what I was waiting for. Show us your hand, sir. I hate real, when people would say that. Real Ness, we watched that video last week, I think. Mike Forge! <laughs> Only run from <laughs> Tubby Cuffs. <laughs> it increased your chance it's of true. getting away. It's true. You just better hope there wasn't a cop like me around the corner. Dog, yeah. That definitely happens. I had uh, one of our rookies... Uh, Totally a track star. Fucking blew the doors off of me in a foot chase. He was fast. <laughs> he was so fast. Can you call he was super fast. Like, I had like a 10 yard head start on this kid, yeah. and he just. Yep. I was like, well, I guess he caught I'm him just too. Catching... He did. He caught that kid him. too. Yeah. I remember that. I wasn't even there. Well, I might have showed up later, but. Yeah, I got a good chuckle out of that. I remember watching your body cam, and he just he went. Just... <laughs> <laughs> Look, I was standing there. I was like, well, I'll help with the fight afterwards. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, well, that'll do Damn. it. That'll do it. Okay, okay, okay. Hit a gun. Hit a gun. Okay. Yeah, dog. Yeah, dog. I do nothing. I do nothing. I got you. Okay. Radio shots fired by the police. Okay. Nails down. Start EMS. Uh, 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 Juan, you want to respond to that message on Instagram? Man, you reach for that gun. Oh, you got one? Another one? Tahoe he just driven by cops and criminals. <laughs> it's true. Chargers, too. Tahoe's Chargers. Yeah, bro, said it. That's true. I'm in Dallas, so. Yes, you did. It might have looked like it, but I promise you I wasn't going to shoot at nobody. Oh my guy. Oh, this is an old school TQ, dog. Oh. With the, I almost wouldn't even want it. With the it's clip. just like the claw and the clip. <laughs> Bro, I wouldn't even want that on my break break. This is for what? For my <laughs> emotional support? Like You know that was his like uh, third tourniquet. He was like, I'm not I'm not gonna use my good one. He and he had a Kimber. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> bro. I swear I wasn't gonna shoot no one. All right. Well, well they do shot you, so don't do that. Oh, this is a long one. Hey, yo, Doc. <laughs> we'll do this later. I missed the Houston videos, Doctor Ching Ching. <sighs> Tubby cop still managed to tase you. That is very true. No, not if you're fast enough. That's true. You only got to make it out of that rule. 21 feet. Yeah. You know how fast yeah, I could shoot you. You know how fast I could cover 21 feet? Uh, Not today, but before. Back in the day. What? Oh, he's just a responding officer. Drop the gun! Drop the gun! Well, that'll do it. Ooh. Ooh. Took his time with two of those. Uh, his backdrop was poo poo, but what are you gonna do when you're getting shot at? How did this guy not handle it? Rifle guy? Yeah. 
He no, might have. I don't know who he might have. Right. Right. Pretty sure that the handgun didn't hit shit. I'm good. Don't move. All right. Hey, hey, one talker. One talker. One talker. My Mark. guy. Wow, what an I animal. Love that. What love an that. animal. He's bleeding now. Suck back. Suck back. Suck back. Do not move. Do not grab back. Go. Go. Move. Go. All of you suck back. Yes, sir. <laughs> he gets it. That was a lot of people. This, they had to have been trying to apprehend this guy. Mm -hmm. My guy with gloves! Bro, this is top this is top tier, dog. Uh don't shoot at police. Yoder? Yes. You're number one. Yoked up dudes here. This is fugitives or SWAT. The jeans make me think it's fugitives. Yeah, the jeans definitely. I'm gonna go I'm gonna go med. I need someone to go to my car and get my aid bag. It's in the passenger seat. Two two three seven. I have two, two, the rookie three, runs. <laughs> There's a rookie right now. I'm just All right. chopping it. If he's got an eight bang, maybe it is swap. Once you guys are here for me to go med, let me know. I'll stay behind you. Yeah, they know who he is. This was warrants. For sure. This could have been swap. Good here. Good here. Yep. Okay. You got cups? Yep. Relax, brother. Relax. Oh, my guy. Can I help you out? Oh, my guy's my guy's likely not conscious for this. So. Uh, is that in the head? No, you cuff him. Okay. Check it for weapons. I'm gonna start cutting while you guys check. Okay. We're all good. Look at his AB tattoo. I tell you what, Real swell those, guys. Those, I'm feeling, I'm, I'm feeling much more SWAT <laughs> than anything. Yeah. The way these guys are handling okay. this. Yeah. Those were two, two, three. Yeah, the rifle guy did handle that. Yeah, that's what I figured. Those are tiny little holes. We got all, mm -hmm. I got a full aid bag. Oh yeah, dude. Oh, this guy's gone. He was firing at me. I don't know. I don't know. I think I'm good, but. Okay, get a tourniquet on. Chest seals and go. If you've got bleeding to an extremity, just throw a high and tight tourniquet on it. Hey, shout out to these uh, chest seals. Look at this guy. Okay, we gotta find that other one. Medical shears. Look at these guys crushing it. Josh has a glove fetish. <laughs> I do. I oh, turn to getting the leg too. Okay, I flip him back over on his back. Keep working that tourniquet, okay? So is the uh um, holster? Yeah. yeah. Is the blonde over there? Would she be like a medic with the SWAT team, or is that a paramedic? Oh, it's a possibility. That's a cop. They might have. It's like probably a cop. That's just a, a cop. cop? Yeah. Okay. Those are both cops. Yeah. yeah. Medical wouldn't be within blocks no. of this nope. they would be nowhere near this nope. even if we told them ahead of time like we're staging medical because we know this guy's armed or whatever if they know we're still apprehending they're staging like a mile away mm -hmm. i like, bet yeah, that we'll siren yeah. the siren you heard was probably an ambulance but this is likely eh, it could be fugitives i just the way they're handling i'm thinking more swap but He's doing chest compressions on a guy with like. So they stop. Well, they stop the bleeding. And yeah. They've applied as much as they could to stopping the bleeding. Now they're trying to make sure if that he's getting blood to the brain. But I'm with you that every single time I see it, I get a little weirded out, and I'm like, no, like, we're gonna make him bleed faster. But it is what it is. Blank Forge, you're not single, so it doesn't matter if the blonde cop is single. We got it. We got it. We got it. <laughs> Agreed. More like not getting a head to see fetish. <laughs> the real mess gets it. Yeah. Uh, yep. As soon as Med's here, I'm going to have them take over my spot so I can just see the eagle. Bloodborne is a cool game series. Daniel, thank it's not you what for you the update. I'm going to have. She's my third wife. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to BCM. Well, if you're marrying cops, it's no wonder that it's not lasting. Yeah, yeah this, was, this was SWAT or some shit. Pretty nice rifle. My work rifle looks like this. The PCM, baby. Yeah. Yeah. How long it was the rifle. This guy. Yeah. I wonder if this was like the end of a pursuit. 
or no, no, or they, it was a warrant, was like a warrant service. Yeah. Mm. They had good information that they would know where he's at and then they serviced it. He's reaching, he's reaching, he's reaching, he's reaching, he's reaching, what he wants back, he's reaching his waist down. Get off the ground! Yeah. Yeah. said she's single next week. I'll tell you what, man. he took care of business. I'm impressed that they could see that from as far away as they were. Yeah. Do not move! All right. We get it. Wow. Shout out to them. Um. <laughs> oh, it was in Vancouver. This chat, this chat is out of control. Probably, probably good to wait for chat to calm down before we read it. Yeah. <laughs> chat's, this chat's out of control right now. He did not survive. Um, do not uh, shoot it, please. Uh, running, you're allowed to do. I, I I believe in that being constitutionally protected. Okay, but... not SWAT. It was just three police detectives, so I'm assuming fugitives. They had to have been in fugitives. There's no just way for you detectives. have that much, that much Well, I'm just saying yeah. they're calling fugitives, I'm sure, like detectives. a detective unit. Yeah. Oh, they do it with, nar with narcotics and stuff like that, too. It's yeah. technically a detective unit. They just specialize in a specific thing. They're also in, like, really good shape, so. Yeah. Yeah. Well, they don't have to Watch be on patrol all the time. No, I'm saying they're probably not sitting at a desk the whole time. Yeah. No, they're not. Is that legal advice? <laughs> <laughs> That's life advice. <laughs> this is like proper traffic. Yeah. Oh yeah, this is I wasn't kidding when I said like oh, traffic get jam traffic. Oh dude, everybody in traffic's fantasy is getting played out right now. Okay. The cop happens to be there when this dickhead decides to go and do this. Mm -hmm. Yep. And it's an Arkansas hey, like, yeah. trooper. Yeah, dude. Good luck. Have fun in jail. Yeah. <laughs> Even if it was just for this. Yep. Also. The Pontiac Grand Prix, living in two, 2022. Shout out. They're from Illinois, so can't afford anything better. Hey, right. <laughs> Trooper Robert State Police, I stopped you for passing on the shoulder, my man. You got your driver's license. My Look man. Seven step, seven step approach and everything. My man. Uh, go ahead, step out for me. And in drive it goes. Any weapons on you? Nothing in the car. So, so what's the deal? She woozy. Why didn't you take her to the hospital back here? Because I had got off right here on my way here. She started saying she was the fellow does. So I got off. Otherwise, I would have never got on. So he had a story. Oh yes, sir. guy. He got rid of the cigarette, bro. This guy. You know what? Game respects game. Right here. Fine Texas. We have don't mess with Texas. That's true. It's a friend of mine. Came to your car. Okay. Let me ask you a question. You smoke marijuana? And be honest with me, because I can smell it on you. Before I got in the car. This chat. I can't walk in the car. There's marijuana in the car. No, there's none. We already smoked it. Okay. So you, where are y'all coming from right now? No, I was coming from the hotel. From the hotel? Yes, sir. Do you smoke back at the hotel? Yes, sir. Okay. Do me a favor, stand right there. Right. She, who is she? Ma'am, you got an idea? Tell you what, you? this is not his first traffic stop. No ID? <laughs> How do you know him? Fred? Any marijuana in the car that you know of? She's going to do a PC search of this vehicle. They gave us the uncut and unedited version of this. Stop answering questions anytime. Until you talk to an attorney or have an attorney present with you for the question. Do you understand those rights? Because the reason I'm going to go in your car is because I can smell the odor of marijuana, not only on you, but also in the car when I went back up there. Uh, that could be because it's on you. Yeah, it's, right. it's, a li it's, it's loud, um, and I can smell it. Uh, it's very strong, okay? Is there anything illegal in the car that I need to know about? No, sir. Nothing at all. Uh, yeah. If it meant, it's good to see you, my dude. Illegal car. Do you 
have medical. What do you think she does for a living? Um, she's a Starbucks barista. I agree. Yeah. I tell you what, they're being pretty chill. Troopers do their own thing here. They're he's wild. I'd have had three cops here by now. Oh, look at that. Hey, there they are. Yeah. My guy. He waited to search until he got a back. My guy. That's pretty legit for a trooper. That's what I'm saying. I've seen troopers that just don't give a fuck. They do their own thing. Oh, shit. Oh, they both. Oh, we it. missed it. Yeah. 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 My brother's gun might be in this car. Okay, stay up around the corner for me. Just ratted her friend out. Yeah. If there's wow. anything illegal, it's his, not mine. Yeah. She's a street masseuse. Jeez. And my sister <laughs> might have something in there as well. Hey! Bro! Oh, damn. Bro, not with your body. Not with your body, not with your body. Man. You heard him? He goes, what the <laughs> My guy. So, potential weapon in the vehicle. He caught that his uh, portable was on and he yep. turned it down so he wouldn't yep. have an echo. I love this guy. I got a man crush on this trooper. Dude's a G. Also, screw this guy. Yeah. That's why you don't drive on the shoulder like an asshole. Bet you that guy saw her pulled over and was like, oh, there's gonna be no car. Oh, she ate the guardrail. Oh, she ate an 18 wheeler. Yeah. It's just a box truck. It's not even an 18 wheeler. No, it's just a. But you can see it a lot better. You couldn't see it this good on the Instagram video. That car is literally split in half. She in there? Yeah, she's alive. Oh my gosh, I believe it! <laughs> the guy's got the suspect in his yeah. car. Yeah, oh my God. He's mad about the car. <laughs> yep. My great Prix! Too, man. No, bro, no, no, she's on under the sea, man. The car is split in half, mama. Oh my God. She's on the phone as well. <laughs> Hey man, you body came here? Pontiac Grand Prix, that's a, uh, that's that's a, rare. That's a classic, classic collector's oh, item at this point. Shout out to this guy for coming to help. He goes, I ain't working this accident. This is this municipal cop problem. Hey, 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 listen, listen, listen. Stay still. Dude, she's got she she don't have a bad good. head injury. No, hey, stay still. Stay still. I'd like still. to move damage vehicle stay across still. the bridge sign. Stay Very still. Appropriate. The iron. The iron. Yeah. <laughs> Typically, the great spot for it. I'm okay, surprised. Ma'am, <laughs> stay still. She split Man, my car, me. mama. Please. <laughs> stay still. Stay still. Listen, you're going to cut your safety. Listen, stop. Stop. No, that's her head injury. She was, she was on the side of the road. Yeah, dude, she's going to have an EBI after that. Yeah. Uh, um, I'll tell you what. Um, if, uh, you challenge a box truck with your uh, motor vehicle, a box truck's likely to work. They're probably going to win that. That's the one with the lift gate, too. It makes yep. it work. That's like a solid steel lift gate. Yep. It's probably with, why like, that rockets. happened. You know, like, oh, oh, so That probably still would have happened even without sit that. Still. Dude, I mean, it's yeah. what I remember from Mike, like, it was like tin foil. Yeah. Come on. Yeah. yeah. I mean, it was like 10, 10 inch thick <laughs> tubing. It's like, that. yeah, dude. I mean, like, it bends a bit when you sit in it. Mm -hmm. I agree, Dylan. Uh, so the reason why. He's telling her to sit still so in case she's got a neck injury. Any kind of movement's gonna exacerbate that. If the car's not on fire, do not extract people from vehicles. You can paralyze them. Fat bam, like Fat like our suspect. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
Y'all are too much today. This chat is the chat. <laughs> Imagine having to explain why your delivery was late to your butt. Dude, I know. You're like, uh, you just take a picture. <laughs> just kind of back up, take a picture, and be like, dog, I don't know what to tell you. This might be a fatality. Oh, he's leaking fuel, too. Yeah. Oh, oh man. That delivery's not coming. <laughs> i tell you that. He's still on the phone with his mouth. Yep. She's well, out the mouth, mama. better luck next time. Yeah, Who sent this? Uh, to meet the Montreal. The Montreal, bro. Oh, nice. This was great. Not that the lady got injured. Right. This is great that you found the video. Yeah, fuck that lady. <laughs> <talking> about. <laughs> oh my god. Crime scene CA. Oh, Kim. Okay. I didn't see the gun at that point, then he got back on his bike right up here. That's when I saw he had a gun. What type of gun was it? I don't know, it was a handgun. It was a, it was a handgun? Yeah, it was oh, a handgun, okay. yeah. Okay. The color, maybe, of it? Um... I always felt dumb asking that question. That's okay. He's wearing black. What? He's wearing black? Okay. He always had, like, they just train you, like, okay. what, what, what did the color, what did the gun look like? What yeah, color what color was, was it? Was he, like, black or silver, like, like pink? On the phone and pink? He, like, you never know. Right Could be. Yeah, dude, that trooper was top tier. I'll be right back. I'll be here. Okay. Alright. I got my Axon body Bible ready. Bicycle tire tracks. We're going. Just need to talk to you. What's that? I got some money to make. What's up with you? Okay. I have some money to make. What are you doing today? Huh? What are you doing in the neighborhood today? You live around here? I'm trying to find some yards to cut. What's up with you? Yards to cut? Yeah. Okay. So you just thirsty. I seen you, bro. You feel me? You not invisible. You feel me? That's all you got to I'm do. I'm not trying ahead. to be invisible. But we got a phone <laughs> like, call from one the of the uh, neighbors in the neighborhood saying that you were riding up into people's yards and trespassing. Okay. <laughs> oh, no. Nah. I knock on the door. And you they say no, I'm gone. You feel me? Uh, okay. There ain't nothing wrong with asking somebody to cut your grass. You feel me? Yeah. No, there's not. Yeah. What's your name, man? I would be team more. getting him off the bike. You got any ID on you? Bro, no. Bro, I'm talking about, what I'm talking about. Are you trying to get my name for? Because you were accused spirit. of trespassing. That's not trespassing, man. When you when you ask somebody to cut their grass, that's not trespassing. When you just chilling in their yard, that's trespassing. You feel me? Right. You feel me? I can okay. see if I had, if I was banned from the yard or something. You feel me? No. Mm. You think he's been, oh, he's going to take off. Pre-attack you. you. He's looking around. No. Look at him looking around. Right. Save him from himself. Bro, why are you trying to take me for it? Save him from himself. Right that's right right. Okay, I understand that. That's not fair. But I still got some points. There you go. There you go. Push, push, right. push, don't pull. There you go. Oh, He's got a gun. Put the gun down now. Why is it always got to go around like this? Why? Oh, Bro, this guy's this cops in it to win it, dog. Stop running! Cars are appropriate Just ways to chase people. Mm -hmm. Middle School. You know, cut oh, good, he tossed the gun. Go, 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 go. Smart. Five eight. I need units over here. Skid away. There it is. There's a genius. Five one. I got him in the parking lot. Carol here is running. Hang on. I was gonna cut the lawn with his teeth, dude. I was thinking the same thing. You're like, what? <laughs> like, Put dude, your hands fuck up. My hand? Yeah. Get on the ground now! Get on the ground! Get on the ground! Get He's got a pair of safety scissors in his pocket. Get on your stomach. Get Let's on see your it. Stomach. Get on your stomach. Let's see it. Get on your stomach, dude. Let's see it. Wow. Wow. Give me some. I can't breathe, shit. No. I can't mm. breathe. I'm hurting. All right, hang on. B minus so far. Get off me, bro. No one's, on you. no one's on you. Pick me, pick me up. Pick me, I can't breathe. Pick me up. Pick me up. I can't breathe. I can't breathe because you, can't breathe you were just I running. Can't breathe. Breathe. Give me up. I can't breathe. Give me off the ground. Okay? Sit right there. I'm going to lock your handcuffs. Take a breath. Take a breath. Oh, then they put those handcuffs on. Got of fucked up, too. Uh, give him a C minus. I still stand by my C minus. I ain't starting that. I'm going to call and be rich. I ain't starting that. Oh, Kim, y'all. Oh, Kim, y'all. Everybody else in chat's gonna give an F. You're the most generous out of everybody. Oh, Kim, y'all, bro. He had to run. 
And this guy was being a little bit uncooperative. Come on, bro. 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 Get, get him fingerprinted, dog. Get him you, failed ID. You know failed ID. Did, take him, take him to jail. All you gotta do is leave me alone. But y'all so racist. Y'all so racist and broke and miserable. Pause it real quick. <laughs> um, pretty common. I, that, I don't want to listen to this guy yell. Um, it's pretty common that people fail to ID you at this point. Just add the charge and leave. Don't looks get stuck like in a, this whole conversation afterwards. Looks like a demon from The Conjuring in the back of that car. He's kind of got that vibe, yeah. <laughs> um, also, is this guy not wearing a vest here? Nah. Is this a police explorer? Why are you not wearing a vest, dog? He's he might cool be. It, it kind of looks like there's a strap there. He's got those like ready to not thin. Kevlar lungs. Maybe because, <laughs> I mean, he also looks like rail thin. So, like, oh, you know what? He just might not be able to see guys. it. You know what? Uh, we had a
Shout out to the chichata in the background, or what do they call them? Locusts? Cicada? Cicada. There it is. This dude, yeah. I've seen him riding up and down dude, the they had locusts, the that'd be real bad. Okay. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, we're done with this. They wouldn't have that many plants, I'll tell you that much. Uh, they would not, you're right. So if you are going on a Tinder date and she pulls up in a white Mazda SUV, that is a red flag, my dude. <laughs> Free advice. Not a guilty car, but is a a two-man unit. Nope. You didn't see this. Is it ride along? Yep. No. Give up a gun. I had two ride alongs that had really good. They had good days. They got good shifts. They didn't get a pursuit and a shootout. That's true. <laughs> That's very true. I'd be like, hey, look that way. Clear that intersection. <laughs> no kidding, dog. <laughs> Do something. You're here. Actually, cycle my sirens. Yeah. These, these, these four buttons just keep cycling these. Clear if all one shots fired. I can feel this road. Clear if all one shots fired. This rider's not trying to have this. Ooh. Oh, oh damn. damn. Wow. That's a rifle, dog. Wow. No, no, no. I was a rifle, dude. Oh, you okay? They get shot? No, I doubt it. No. Oh, just crying. Get over it, dog. You're in a police car. <laughs> I would tell them to oh, chill out. Is it? No apprehension. We get them. I knew it was a rifle. Passenger. I called it. Well, it was a pistol. But there was too much muzzle flash there for. A handgun. Wow, two of the rounds did go through the windshield. Oh, that, yeah, that's... Oof. That was a bad day. The officer had recently been released from training and was on his second week as a solo no. officer. Oh, wow. Did they give him a ride a lot? Yeah, that was pretty normal. Yeah. Oh, no, nobody wanted, nobody oh, wanted right. riders. Makes, yeah. sense, Veteran cops gotta, don't yeah. want riders. Dog. Yeah. What scene I, was that? Oh, I don't know. Oh, okay. bro. That was, yeah. At that point, I'm probably terminating that. Like, self-terminating because I have a writer with me. But, like, they're not volunteering to die. I am. But I tell you what, though. I'm probably shooting back at that thing. If I'm going to let it go like that, whatever. Uh, a few rounds off. Maybe. They only let it go because the vehicle was disabled. Oh, the car got Yeah. Canned? I'm assuming one of those rounds went into the engine. Yeah. Dang. So... It was a Draco Mini, likely. A Draco Mini. Hey, Juan, can you drop that link from Instagram to the Discord for me? Yes. Give the passenger a grenade launcher. This guy's putting a jacket on. Is he cold? Maybe. Is this a backup officer? How's it going? I'm the caller. Okay. Mm -hmm. gotcha. Oh, there's snow like, outside, what, what but it's cool. Stolen. I have it on GPS. Yeah. I've been talking to you guys for 30 minutes. You guys just keep telling me how everything that you can't do. Your dispatch, okay. right? Uh, and I'm not throwing it on you. This guy's not happy. But, you know, she, oh, we can't do this. We can't do that. I'm... Security hey, I'm has this car detained. Like, if that's what you guys really want. I got you. So I have it right here. If you want to start calling it on your radio, yeah, no, so here's the vehicle. I, we have different areas. Different officers are dis dispatched to their different areas. So right. I could different take a look. Work the call, and I could see where it's at. And I could let the other officers in that area know kind of where it's at. To recovered it's vehicle. Right down the street here, man. Verify that so he's... Oh, right it's here. not there. It's right here. It's what nearby. Kind of I see. Is I see. Audi? 2016 Audi Q3 Black. It's now headed westbound on... Where? Locust Street. Can you take a look at it yep. a little closer? For sure. You said it's been all over the city. How? When, when, when did you park it here? Just to get a time frame. It, it was stolen probably 45. Once you guys stop it and we stop the vehicle. I'm probably apprehending they went. it. Okay. The whole huh? Trip. Gotcha. Can I have my coat? I, I would just be more so concerned on. about okay, apprehending cool. it rather than yeah. okay, getting perfect. the information for the report. Uh, for get that CPU. later. Has, is there a way to follow like a route that has been taken, or is it just you can see the whole live? route? I can tell you live. Yeah, I don't want okay. to take it off live because I don't want them to know the vehicle's being tracked. I got you. Okay. Yeah, at this point, it is already 
It keeps traveling. So it's even been then, 120 yeah. miles an hour. They're moving around. So. Okay. And those are, I guess, the indications of when it stops, hard stops. When it stops, okay. yep, takes off. Okay. Uh, so listen, I don't want to bust your balls. No, you're fine. But if you guys can't stop them, I'm going to take a lift and go home and get my vehicle, and I'm going to stop. Based. Yeah. Nice. I, I get both sides. I just want to know what you yeah, guys are no. going to do. I tell you what, so, so whatever stole Bill's truck, this was exactly what would happen. I would call the police. <laughs> All the police are going to do is get in my way. Yeah. It's in the it's in the vehicle. Okay. I'd go stop it with you. Um, a lot of times. I know you would. No, I'm saying we'd oh, make, no, it stream, would <laughs> make it a stream, dude. Make it a stream. Juan's so, yeah, there with the gimbal. I'd be in the back with the um, camera, yeah. Well, we need Juan's car to, to uh, get it. Because here's the thing. To catch so it. Let's get yeah. it. Yeah. Yeah. When it's property crime like that, a lot of these guys. Yeah, because yours would fall right apart, dude. 100. That causes a whole other liability if it crashes, gets totaled. Or if it runs He's over. Trying to I'm going to go get another one of my vehicles and run into them. Or That's fine. I'll stop them. They're yeah, not going to keep moving for me. I have insurance. Well, like, well, like we mentioned. It's... I'm legally allowed to run into my own vehicle. It's my property. Uh, okay, pause guy. it real quick. Our dispatch already told you. This guy This guy is, is being way too extra. No. No, 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 no. no. Um, you're likely to be charged with aggravated assault. Yeah. If you hit somebody intentionally with a vehicle. Um, but what if it's, it's a lot like of... super based? <laughs> so he's not technically wrong he's not wrong that it's his vehicle and it's his property he is not in possession of said property right now yeah. so it technically could be intentional i don't know if they'd go aggravated assault but they could if they were to if he was to run into the other car and hurt the driver like it's the same shit that you run into with like the burglar fell in your house and broke his leg like it's that stupid stuff but there's no reason to act like that either like i understand your car's been stolen you're pissed but like acting like that is just going to make the cops want to do less for you yep one thousand percent to be honest someone came at me with an attitude like that i'd be like all right i can't give you legal advice but just understand that if i'm showing up and that's what's going down you might have a really hard time They already advise you what you should should not do. I'm not gonna tell you sure. what way to go about this because yep. I know how your perspective is as well. Absolutely. At the same time, I want you to understand that. Okay. I get it. All I'm saying, man, is listen. It's right here. Mm -hmm. If you guys don't want to go, it's okay. Like I'm not gonna bust well, anyone's balls. All I'm saying is I'll go get it, but no. the phone call is gonna be much different. It's not gonna be an emergency at that point. You have to also Pause it. That. <laughs> do not. <laughs> Bro, they're gonna be like, "This is murder one, like yeah. it's premeditated murder." <laughs> yep. Like, and it's all on body camera. You, this so. does not make you cool, dude. If you're yeah. gonna go and be Judge Dread about it, don't tell the cops ahead of time. You're fucking. Idiot. Also, how do you get your Audi stolen? I'm guessing he left the keys in the car. Yeah, That's what I'm guessing. Chadwick. <laughs> like, oh, like you God. mentioned. There's multiple jurisdictions that be interacted. We just can't pass channels automatically like that. So that's why we're saying. I'm assuming watch where it's this guy's going from jurisdiction to jurisdiction. 100%. They're just kind of playing kick the can in this match. It was here. It was in Arvada. It's back. So, I got you. again, I don't have a jurisdiction. I'll go get it. It, it can be wherever. It can be Colorado Springs. I'll stop Agreed. It. You do not have a jurisdiction. Um, A uh, hold up alarm. There's real calls going on, and we're worried about your car, dog. Like I mentioned, hold up alarm at a circle K. That's probably legit. Probably legit. I'm watching it right now. It's still in Denver. It stopped like four times. You guys have had multiple opportunities. We've been sitting for like ten minutes. Which you have to understand as well. Is, oh, all ten minutes. There's not just officers oh. everywhere, just at all times. It's there. been oh, four minutes. Nine hours for somebody to show up. So, so if they're tied up, unless he was yeah, sitting there overnight. I'll handle him, Sam. Quick, <laughs> so so premeditation. That real nose gets it. That. That's why. Where's the car? It's right here. It's going off westbound of. I wonder where it was stolen out of. This is not yeah, yeah, locations. Yeah, it it, it won't go the streets, but. You can pull up their address right there. Oh, okay. oh so it gives general areas. Cool. Yeah. Yeah. Also, probably at a Run pretty big it. delay. Real mess. Yeah. <laughs> I know you're frustrated. I get what you're saying, but <laughs> that's really funny. Unfortunately, <laughs> that would be incredible. Um, that would be the be biggest win. 
3201 Clayton Street. So in this instance, I would have one officer stay there and get on the radio and give updates to the uh, responding officers to walk them into it. Or take the guy's phone. If it's even in their city. Yeah. Like I mentioned, I get the pressure. I understand. I can still do just the report for now, just so it's advised. So it's just, there's a description out there. There's locations that we can actually be on the lookout, basically send information out to our officers in any jurisdiction. To be able to have I'm just going to do the vehicle. I'm going to go get it. So you don't want to report when you get For what? Because it's going to help document it. So if other officers document are there. Document what? I'm going to go get the vehicle. Have you, you guys will have a, have so a lot ever, of documentation to make you, here soon. Have you ever had a this guy's such a douchebag. So I'm trying to explain to you the process of reporting it stolen. We need your information. Yeah, it's not even if reported it's stolen reported, yet. So we can put that if it's system, reported stolen, right, they can do I'm, something I'm about it, but it has to be reported stolen. Report with you, right? Right now, to tell you about all this information, also, you know, if it's reported stolen, it'll pop vehicle, on yeah. LPRs right and, and stuff like that. So like, I'll call you when they're on the ground, and then you guys come and get them. That's oh, you're such a tough guy. You're so tough. How does it not work that way? Imagine if they try to pull over a Draco guy. Yeah. Right. You're so tough. All of a sudden. Write me, man. Write me. Do what you gotta do. This guy's such. I'm good. I'm not saying that's the outcome. I'm just saying that's. Yeah. Okay. Reported stolen. Do the thing. Like. And if they pull a rifle on me, then I'm justified. Yeah, you're good to go. But the thing is, if they're not, and you're justified to mean Jesus. Yeah, you're good to go. But the thing is, if they're not, and you're justified to mean Jesus. Yeah, you're good to go. But the thing is, if they're not, and you're justified to mean Jesus. Yeah, you're good to go. But the thing is, if they're not, and you're justified to mean Jesus. Yeah, you're good to go. But the thing is, if I don't know, man. Maybe this know, guy's SEAL Team it. 6 or whatever, but I like, got you. Like, I don't know. Sorry, Fast forward, does he actually go? They got the air tied up. Um, you got okay. his information. Can start this. Time to get that. <laughs> She's like, can we start this? Can we be done? I feel like if he knows, supposedly knows where it is, and it's been stopping, why don't you just follow it, wait till it stops, get it at yourself and drive away. Uh, you're a sole register owner. Yeah. You get your buddy. Your buddy drives your other car. Maybe because I, I rent the Montero, so maybe the that's uh, probably stripped, I don't know. Hey, Brazil right now, but I'm gonna go home and get- uh, He rents them on Turo? Uh, Range Rover. And You're such a douchebag. So then is it- Because I was waiting for the his car? 45 minutes. Just got a sign about him in the government. I'll tell you, I'll be honest. No, I got you. It's not you, man. I'm not, I'm not busting your ball, bro. It's, I get it. We've been waiting for the cops. So I'm gonna go home and get the Range Rover, and then I'm gonna go stop the He has re-emphasized the- All He right. probably never found this thing. He did. No. We're not going to see oh it. Oh my god. Did you read, I just the, read title? the title? Yeah. Is, is there any access he to that? smoked a kid for doing a joyride. This is the only way you can okay. have fun in prison, dog. Oh my god. So. Oh, the kid was armed. Unless the dude did a drop gun on him. Maybe. How would you know, right? Wow, they didn't charge him. No. That's crazy. Wow. What so he got this? to he got to kill a twelve year old, and now oh. Man, imagine what a douchebag he's going to be now because he thinks he's a hundred percent, dude. A hundred percent, dude. I don't know, man. I wish we would uh, watch that video. Yeah, whatever. Also, like, in case you're a uh, aspiring young thief, don't steal people's Excuse cars me. and get into gunfights. You will likely lose. Oh, did you see anybody out here with their pants down by chance? No. He's in Tifa okay. Five. Was it you? <laughs> Millennial Cup. Okay. Jesus. Okay. Okay. <laughs> They just gave us a description, and unfortunately, you match that description. Yeah. And we want to make sure. That... Oh yeah, no. <laughs> so, right. how long you been out Shout here? Shout out to the vape. Uh, about ten minutes. Ten minutes. Yeah. It's totally that guy that they're talking to. <laughs> Twelve to sixteen. That'll be the guy. So who who called and who saw what? She I did, called yes. in, and I mean, it was hands on the pants. There he goes. Oh, yes. Did you hear me? Yes. Yeah. He, oh, he well, said, well, 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 he didn't really have a detention. Or maybe you did. Depending on what the accusation is. Use your car. 
Look at this guy chopping. Oh my god, Drew down. Did he pull a gun? I don't know. Shout out to the sirens you already here. He's your car. Dark colored jeans. Looks like he's running. Run, boys. Can you describe this tally wiker man? Gross. <laughs> he did not cross the bridge. <laughs> to Montreal, I wish I could tell you, dog. <laughs> Someone should have stayed with him. You don't need three cops to interview a lady. Oh, they're at the they're at the jog now. Well, yeah, listen, he said it wasn't bro. him, so like <laughs> clearly it wasn't him. Bro, why are we stopping? Show me your hands now! Oh, we found him. Come out from underneath the car with the hands out now. Bro, this guy gets an A+. Plus. Get under there? Damn. Hold him there. Hold him there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hold him there. I oh, like shit. that. I literally wasn't going Shut there. up, man. <laughs> ah, this guy gets an A+. Plus. S tier policing, dude. To think to look under the car. Let's see what we're doing handcuffing. Keep scooting out. Let's see how we don't have. Look at the look at the little wrist lock, dog. Okay, gold. Let's see it. Let's see it. F. D F. or F? Yeah, F. dude. This is no. taking way too long. No. Nope. <laughs> <Even F. laughs> you can see it in the reflection of the vehicle. He's got one on. They don't even have the other arm around. That's an F. I got it. Why'd you run, man? Oh, and you put your hand in his hand, bro. What are we doing? That's an F. F. No double lock? Well, if you didn't get a, if you didn't do it, I didn't do it. Bro. Okay, so why would you run? That was the weakest frisk I've ever seen. I'm just gonna check you. There it is. Don't care. Uh, at that point, uh, he's checking for his tally whacker. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know, man. Solid D. <laughs> Daniel, you're. <laughs> It was probably yeah, a soft B you. at that point. It but. was a soft yeah. B. It was a soft B. Might have been solid before uh, the cops showed up. On June 12th at 11.25 a.m., <laughs> our this? deputies responded to an armed robbery at Orange Gate Park in the Summit area of Tacoma. Our deputies arrived on scene and talked to the victim, a woman who told us that... But they have George Washington on their come out of the, the wood line <laughs> with a gun Incredible. at her and demanded her keys wow. and her purse. That suspect then stole her vehicle and took off. What does it look like a cloth uh, Luckily, patch? in this situation, it is. She I'm had it's a Velcro patch. Installed inside oh, her okay. vehicle, which led deputy straight to the suspect. I've never seen up that. In Holding away. hands is an agent. Believe the car was empty. It hadn't been moving, <laughs> but as they approached, the suspect had much. just walked in and sat down and started the car. From there, it took us on a <laughs> pursuit trying much. to catch this suspect down through Fife onto I-5 South. The pursuit continued on I-5 South. And when they got just south of 56th Street, deputies were able to successfully <laughs> you like his little Hulk on his dash? Vehicle yeah. stopped on the side of the freeway. Car wrecked out. Get it blocked in. Get it blocked in. I tell you what, these guys are in it to win it. That park, out of the car. From there, the suspect took off on foot, leaving his passenger behind. Push him. Good push. Nice. As soon as deputies got the suspect into custody, they turned around and saw the vehicles were on fire. There is a female in the car. Deputies uh -oh. rushed back well, and then bad. realized the woman in the passenger seat had not gotten out of the car yet. Can, can we push that car? Got a fire extinguisher, dude. Oh, bro. Oh, the grass Someone's caught on fire. Oh, the grass caught on fire. Yeah. Put a lid on and it. That is where I am going to pass this off to Tacoma police officer Shelby Boyd. Whoa. Thanks. Oh, they got it. So officers were in the area of 38th a Street when they heard the pursuit on I-5. Once the pursuit oh, seemed to have ended separately. around 56th Street, they went down to the scene to see if the deputy I think they're different out. agencies. Once they were yeah. there, the officers realized yeah. that there was somebody still in the car, put on their gloves, and went to work. Take a look. I hate this. Script. this. This script I is hate awful. This. <laughs> I hate everything about this. Is there a baby in this car? No, I think it's just close. Stand up. What? Yeah, fuck your true. smoke inhalation. Is your taste in men? What? You know what? Get away! Get away! Get away! Shut up, fire! Stand up. 
Hey, bro. She's a helpless passenger, okay, dude? The woman was That's clear in the passion. fire. Deputies were trying to put out the vehicle fires. Don't be so mad. Oh, it's spreading. It's such dry grass. Also, fire extinguisher material sucks. Yeah. Like, it gets everywhere. You're so dirty after that. If only there was, like, a, a unit or, like, a... That, like, specifically dealt with that? Like, a Some department. Kind of like, and someone, if they could if they could someone that worked in the same cities as yeah. police officers did. Yeah. Yeah. If only they, like, had they big... They like specialty equipment for that? Big mm -hmm. trucks that carried, like, hundreds of gallons of water. Yeah. If only they had something like that. I wonder. Right? Maybe one day. Mm -hmm. You know Maybe what? AI but now. But but at least no. at least officers were able to replace something incredible like oh, that. With a, oh look with at that! Car. Oh my gosh! <laughs> Ooh! Wow! Yeah. Dang! Barbecued. That's rough. Inside and out. Oh, oh my gosh! Wow. It melt. Holy crap! Hey. Oh, so there was a gun in the car. Look at that. I'm not listening to them again. <laughs> Good for them. Do you don't want the their forced banter? No, I don't. No, no. <laughs> I knew the fire department. Right, stay outside. Stop. Is there more people in there? Okay. This was the most based uh, non-American police interaction I've seen in a while. You can tell who put this in the Discord. One, two, right, it's emergency <laughs> <laughs> Keith, Keith, they're probably busy like rubbing oil all over each other, so I get it. Stop it, stop it now! Look at that. Stop the Stay where you are! Stay where you are! Stay where you are! Put your hands together! Let's see it! Oh, hey, coming in the front? Negative a million. Damn. <laughs> Retire. Who's checking out the store? Uh, I will say this. Go back to it's pretty much done. Go back to where they first make contact. This guy flinches like a chihuahua that just got caught. He's like, "Oh no, not me, bro." That's that's what happens wow. when you get some alpha male energy in the room. Damn. Oh my goodness! When we're doing our search, we're not going to find an ID or anything else that with your name on it. Like I've asked for four times. She found ID. Probably. Is she gone? Oh no, not the UK. <laughs> Yo. Oh, you're licked. Best Hello. I can do. Hi. My name's Officer Thuman. The reason I stopped you was because you didn't uh, stop for that red light and continue to the intersection. In, in public really? with lip piercings. It's, it's <laughs> gotta be a crime somewhere. And, uh, we still had a green light for westbound traffic. Did you notice that when you hit the brakes? No? Okay. Where are you coming from today? Okay, I'm right, headed to. Huh? Where are you headed to? Um, to my house. Okay, do you have an ID with you? My dungeon. You don't have. Do you have anything with your picture on it? No. Okay. Get a verbal. Do you have any like, debit card or credit card? I'm assuming you paid somehow with for that. Yeah, I paid cash. Okay. Do you have a receipt for that then? Um, no, that was just. Right. It wouldn't have her name okay. on no, it. No, I see that. I see that. You don't have it anything with your name on it though. Just not okay, spelled correctly. What's her correct. last name? Um, M A L A. K O W S K Y and Taylor's person. Taylor, okay. Just remain in your vehicle, oh. okay? Got a doctor like that? Three one seven eight. Does county have a canine on? Well, she's not a cop speeding 120 miles an hour down the <laughs> road, so we could show her face. We could show her face. Taylor and Michael, can you find a photo and send it to me? One. <laughs> <laughs> hey, keep them accountable. Was that okay. magnetic? Bro, we had latches Neat. for our uh, in-car radios. That looked magnetic. Look, I want to see it again. Hold yeah. On. Look. Oh, oh, it's it totally is. magnetic. Oh, 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 oh that's that good. was cool. That's a satisfying click. That was nice. A meth instructor. <laughs> <laughs> Hi. Any luck with that? No, he said he doesn't have insurance. Okay. Would you be willing to step out of the vehicle for me and yeah. talk to me? Yeah. No FMFR. 
Also, in my city, this is okay. depending on who pulled so, you over. This thing's probably getting towed. If you don't have a driver's license and there's no insurance, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, first of all, do you have any probably getting towed. Would you let me just yeah. pat you down, make sure you don't have any weapons on you? Okay. No knives or anything nope. like that. Wow, she consented okay. to a pat down. So, that was smooth. Why don't we step back right here right. so we're not in the middle of the road? Right. Okay. So just be honest with me, okay? Yeah, yeah. yeah. I don't think that you are who you, who you say you are. Why? That, the, the photo that I looked at doesn't look like it's you. Yeah, yeah. It was issued in 2020. 2020. It also doesn't come back to a Rhinelander address like you had said. It comes back to a different address. Carry in, Correct. Correct. Right, right, right. okay. Well, I moved to Rhinelander. I mean, okay. I moved to Rhinelander. So, are you who you are? Yeah, I mean, yeah. just to be yeah, straight with yeah, me? Yeah, yeah, I am. Okay. I am who I am. Um, it just looked different than what okay. the... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I have my hair and stuff since then. Okay, you so have. Like, yeah, okay. yeah, And that's why I'm asking yeah. these, these yeah. additional questions. Okay. okay. Is there anything Started that doing yoga. It got weird. To... Um, <laughs> with those ears, it'd be pretty easy to tell that it was you. Okay. Like you don't I... have like a debit card, like a food card. <laughs> I've been pre now. I just came here because I'm trying to get a better job. Okay. What are you having like your wallet? Like, do you have? Any... Like, she needs like, to go been... back to whatever just... world she so came out of Lord of the Rings from. <laughs> <laughs> She's been working in my outfit. That's why they got. Actually, you know what? She kind of looks like Gollum. So. What do you know your social security number? Just gonna say my precious. She's a method actor. She was the, in the new video game, the Gollum video a game. A meth so oh, really? actor? Is there yeah. Meth actor. Yeah. Yeah. Meth uh, it was on. <sighs> I believe it was one of the streets because I, I was staying with um. Andromeda gets it. Boyfriend. Or was it okay. Fourth Street? I, I don't know. Off the top oh right, no way. Here, I didn't know NTTA. It was like one of the. Uh, Mike from Magnetic. Street. Shout out. Okay. You know what I mean? Like Wait, NTTA, are, are you a Texas person? Yeah. My guy. My boyfriend is really... Something else okay. that, that with the wind, but, um, okay. Taylor, why don't you just have a Your boyfriend, car, okay? Frodo? And you're confident Whoa. that you, that's, that's yes, who you are. Yes. Frodo would never have to. Um, <laughs> Frodo's got taste. That's right. Says, you never know. Said, well, Ian, what's going on? This is a messy situation. You are right. Frodo changed after he had that ring for a while, so... I'm not a huge fan of canine sniffs in cars, but nope. it is what it is. Not either. Thank you. That's some real okay. questionable constitutionality to that. Um, is there anything in the vehicle that we should be aware of? Okay. Any needles or anything? Not that I know of. Shouldn't be. Okay, because we're going to be conducting a search, okay? Um, it's not my car. Oh, I understand that. But so, uh, you're operating it. In front of my vehicle, okay? <laughs> okay. okay. So, well, my guy, again, we're in DFW. I'll come say hi. Who you are, is that what you're saying? Yeah. Just because it gave me some second Damn, thoughts. Damn, went downhill and standard. Like I said, yeah. that DOT photo. You'll probably see me. I break down on the tollway all the time. So it's not too far Sergeant far George, which one? Long ago, right? Um, when did you get your piercings? Hey, Dr. June June. Okay. Says, hey, Juan, if you can, at? if possible. Yeah, I'm going to check that out. Okay. Okay. Um, I know I have a few streams on YouTube. Oh, no, interesting. You about it. Do you know yeah. Well, numbers? so I think we have to have memberships on that, but I don't have them on. Actually, because we do everything through Patreon, and I didn't know how to get people's memberships from YouTube you to the again. Discord okay. without me having to do it manually, oh, which so I was coming across. To do. Heads on the way. So I'll check it. Cool. Yeah, I just want to address something with her here now. So, Erica, why, why didn't <laughs> me, you I'm you playing a dude who's put disguised as a dude out. as another um, dude. <laughs> confident that when we're doing our search we're not going to find an ID or anything else that with your name on it like I've asked for four times um, yeah I'm actually lying okay so who are you oh. it's not my first day out here Dallas my okay. guy what's your last name Brian. okay why didn't you want to give me that information in the first sense. place okay so I said don't have a license she that. kept it up for a while she did she was committed anything else don't just stop. Yeah, she has about five hundred dollars cash. Oh man, she so just stopped at Culver's too. Bro, that sucks. The scale. Her concrete mixer is gonna melt. I bet this smells like patchouli. Dude, I was thinking the same. Oh, man, we're on a wavelength, dog. <laughs> I, like, literally could smell it. Yep. 100%. Sergeant George, she does not look like Brienne of Tarth. No, Brienne of Tarth's doing a lot better than this. 
Don't you dare disrespect that woman. Not to mention she was blonde. That too. Mm -hmm. And way bigger. Stores way bigger. It's that proper muscle mass. She took out the hound, bro. Fuse compartment Sorry. has a bunch of fuses missing and wide open. Crap. Oh. The only hounds this lady's dealing with are the ones sniffing her for drugs. Yeah, I just found a ticket for Erica Go on. Go on out here with one-liners. Okay. So why don't you step in front of my car here? I'm going to search you. Okay. No needles. Yep. I think it's going to poke Is this hurt search me. incident to arrest? Or are we searching her? Just curious. Also, how are you going to search with gloves on, dog, like those? Use, use non-sterile gloves. Mm. Can't feel shit through so, Titan gloves. Some change here? Yeah. Are we are we so searching or what are we doing? Looking for a tip. Okay. Um, Newports. Oh, it's a meth. She's not in she's not in custody. And the needles, obviously, right? Yeah. Bro, is that a carbon fiber hood? Kind of looks like it. Your teeth gave away the meth. So, talk to me about the cash now. Just over five hundred dollars or so cash. Um. And all the individual <laughs> drugs. I mean, like I can't with you today. No, I know, I know, I know. I don't like sell drugs like that. I really don't. Why do you have a whole baggie? I will explain search incident to arrest here in a second. It's not even like that. In a scale, I'm pretty sure there's a scale. In okay. All right. Cool. Good. Sounds, Sounds great. Is she in custody? She she not in custody yet? Are we not arresting her? There we go. Now we're arresting her. All right. Yep. Anything else that you'd like to be in your belongings? Okay. I have to determine, I guess. So there's typically three ways a search is going to happen, right? One, you have some sort of exigency that you can articulate for a search. So like you see something in plain view. So at that point, you're probably also going to have like PC for something. Um, two, you get a warrant, which you're going to have to do like a lot of reporting and investigating. You got to type the thing up, send it off to a judge. Judge has got to sign it. Three is going to be consent search, um, which can be revoked at any time. You can look at the case law for it. Search incident to arrest is they're already in custody. You're going to be taking them. You have PC for the arrest. And so you're searching their persons and anything within their control, including a car you would be able to do. So I thought it was weird that he was searching her and she wasn't already in custody or they knew about drugs and stuff. And she like put her in handcuffs, do what you got to do and then search her then as opposed to searching her before putting it. Even if you know you have PC, if you haven't arrested her, if you find something that's on her, you might have a lawyer that's like half decent that could be like totally kick anything you find on that. If you're not articulating it as search incident to arrest or if it's like a voluntary search. It's just weird. I never liked doing voluntary searches. A, because our department was lame and made us fill out like paperwork. You couldn't take it verbally, but yeah. My guy. Look, it's like it's like Inception. It's he's, like Inception. He's, he's in our here. chat, and we're gonna watch one of his videos. <laughs> Shout out. And we were the first yes. like. <laughs> Look at that. So search incident to arrest is once someone's in custody, you are then searching them. Uh, mostly, obviously, for the jail and all that kind of stuff, but also to. Um... So he sent us this and said he was in the area. I think he was still working security at the time. Heard gunfire, called the police. Witness said that they saw someone shoot a bunch of rounds into an apartment. So DPD's doing a welfare. Oh, check. like a welfare? Yeah. It's my video! <laughs> <laughs> I tell you what, DPD gets down. God bless Ooh. him. But hell yeah, kick it. Check for traps though. Yeah, <laughs> so dude. Check for traps. Peek it, dude. Don't get Nora Charles. <laughs> yeah. Where's your revolver? Come on. I'm also team donkey kicks on this. Uh, he's he's keeping his shield for ballistic protection. The only downside is there's no one that can really like return lethal fire here. So I'd just say donkey kick it and get the hell out of the way. Yeah. And have lethal cover. Free advice for those of you that'll ever have to find yourself in a position to kick a door. Better for your D's. One of you holds gun on lethal, the other one donkey kicks. Front kicks are for losers. Come on, Sarge. Get it together. You gotta kick close to that door handle, my guy. Yeah, that too. 
kick in the middle of the door ain't gonna do shit. I, mm -mm. I will say this though, apartment doors can be legit hard to kick in. Yeah. It'd be really funny if it was unlocked. <laughs> I have done that. Like an idiot on a welfare check, kick a totally unlocked door. I've done it to an interior door, which is way worse and more embarrassing. Donkey kick it! You got a nice little guard railing? Come on, my dude. Flying kick. I'm not mad about how many kicks it takes. I do have body cam footage of me kicking a door like 50 times to get it to open. <laughs> but I donkey kicked it the whole time. I mean, shout out to this apartment complex for having safe doors. Yeah, dude. You get two of your buddies to grab you like a battering ram and you stick your legs out. Yep. Boom. Oh. Like, all right, Sarge, I got it. Donkey kick. Come on, my dude. One kick. One Watch. big kick. Watch. Oh, oh, come on. There was the jump. flying <laughs> kick. <laughs> I called it. He goes, I got kicked. Oh. This, is probably, this is likely maintenance. This is likely oh, of course, maintenance. Yeah. 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 He goes, dog, I got a key. He doesn't want to fix the door he's tomorrow. He's been waiting at the bottom of the stairs. <laughs> Just watching. <laughs> Use the shield as a ram. Also would not work very well. Nope. Great way to just go smack. Use a ram. Uh, we did not have a ram on patrol. Only sergeants had rams. And use the good and old even then, I don't think Yeah, we're four guys. No. We're four guys? <laughs> oh, the key didn't work. Oh, damn. There it is. <laughs> oh, I guess we don't get well, too okay. lost I guess it was just fun to watch them kick it. <laughs> I, I'm not going to make fun of them for how many kicks it took, but we are critiquing the hell out of uh, form. Yeah. Always donkey kick. It's so much better for your hips and your knees, yeah. and you get a lot more force behind it. <laughs> Maintenance try not to fix the frame. Dog, they got so mad. Every time they showed up after the fact, they got big mad. Oh, uh, why are you running, bro? What the fuck you want, bro? Come here. <laughs> Come here. Criminal, bro. That's why. Oh, yeah. good thing. He jumped the Dude. fence, heading towards 77. Shout out to this guy. He's in it to win it. I already got a man crush on this He's dude. On the White male, keep, red shirt, blue jeans. Keep uh. Fuck you run, keep your gun hand out. free. Keep the gun hand free. Oh, there it is. Hey, look, at that, look at that brass ejection, dude. That was beautiful. Yeah, no kidding. <laughs> he said, check yourself. My guy. Damn. Hey, sometimes it doesn't pay off to win the foot race, dude. Bro, no, I think it was like a grace. He said the frame for the door wasn't damaged. <laughs> that press check. Come on, dog. Damn. Yeah, I got cover. Oh, this guy. The slightly less fast officer here. <laughs> this is me. <laughs> Catching up to <the> Bill. <laughs> no, you would have took oh, the car. Fell. I'd have been with you. He fell lots of sunglasses. Hey, why don't you get your gun out, dog? <laughs> there you go. <laughs> he, he was putting his glasses back on. Check yourself. Check yourself. Hey, but he's in it to win it. He's telling him, hey, make sure you're not shot. Yeah. I'll handle this. That's a pretty decent backup. Bro, are we catching up with all the videos for tonight? Hell yeah. Mm -hmm. First Marine Division tattoo. My guy. 2021. The police department Shout out to the Aimpoint Acro. Of a burglary of a business. It did look like an acro. occurred at 280 Hagara Street. 22 First hours later, a second the real burglary of business was reported <laughs> at 157 Hagara Street. Burglary. With security camera video, Damn. investigators oh, were able to link both burglaries as being committed by the same person driving the same vehicle. However, the suspect in the video was wearing a mask and their identity remained unknown. On May 10th at approximately 4 a.m., police Don't were do that in my neighborhood. business burglary 
at 120 Tank Farm Road. That looked like Just a business. Just 90 minutes later, a fourth oh, burglary occurred at 888 Ricardo Court. I hated Again, these nights. security video showed yep. what appeared to be the same vehicle, a light-colored GMC Envoy, as seen in the previous burglaries. After conducting the background check and just hours after the fourth burglary, detectives went to Jerome's address on Camilla Court and found the same light-colored GMC Envoy in each no of the previous burglaries. Some of the items reported stolen in the burglaries could be observed in plain view <laughs> through the windows <laughs> of the vehicle. Crazy. Not super smart. This will likely be fugitives. I'm not a huge fan. Of so standing in front of that window. big ass window? Yeah, I'm not a huge fan of that, but. What a good way to get smoked. It sucks though being the guy that has to knock on the door. Yeah. Because you just get left. <laughs> Everybody yeah. else is like, hey, dog, let me know how it goes. Edward, you're on. Edward, open the door. Hey, my dude, catch your breath. About to get spicy, probably. Edward, it's the police department. Open the door. How do they Come know this on, guy's name? Edward. Name? They for sure have a warrant address. since they're yeah. forcing entry. Yeah. Wow, oh, look yeah. at that. Yeah. Search it from the outside. My guy. Edward, I respect it. Somebody hold the door open. <laughs> Oh. Shots fired, shots fired. What is my dude doing? Contribute. What are we doing? He's got a gun, he's shooting at us. All units, all units. What? What is he doing? He's, he's comms. I guess, Doc. We're a pussy. <laughs> I'm just a little like, hey, are there still cops up there? He wouldn't know. He ran away from all of them. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> are we getting, he going to drive off? Is he, he grabbing his something? rifle? That might make more sense. Yeah, he's getting the rifle. I don't know. I, maybe he was hands before. Well, I don't know the, what the fuck is going on here. Rack one in, my dude. Here we go. Shout out to aim point. Oh. Well, if he wasn't involved, he is now. What was going on here? I don't know. Can we call it out on the radio? What's going on? You got cops in front of you, Doug. Are you gonna call the cops back? He's mute. He's mute. <laughs> Where's everybody else? Okay, there's him. Are you okay, Steve? He's in the head and the arm. Oh damn! Damn! What a fucking animal, dude. I'd be like, hey, do some uh, self rescue, Doug. Yeah. I got lethal. I think so. He came out, he pointed his gun at me. Because I'm hitting the head and the arm. That guy's calm as fuck for being shot. Well, he's in shock. Yeah. Jesus. What an animal. For what? An Let's help our buddy, I think. Mm-hmm. Um, I mean, he was in it to win it afterwards, but yeah, you, you don't, in that situation, him bailing off the stairs makes a lot of sense because what the fuck are you going to do up there, right? You're trying to get out of the way and give that officer, the contact officer, the guy that ended up taking rounds, uh, space to move. If he feels like he needs to retreat, he can, or if he feels like he's going to go take the fight to him, give him that choice. But like totally bailing on the situation, I'm just not going to give, you don't want to do it because now you don't know what's going on. Right, like if there's an officer that's down, or if they're like hands on and need help, or something crazy like that. If if you're alone, you figure out where the there was four other cops that are there. It's my only advice. I wasn't there. 
the guy's at least brave enough to do the job. I'm not going to give him too much criticism for that. However, um, free advice if you want to do some mental exercises for this is if you have other people, you want to know where they're at. Um, we had an incident uh, a couple weeks ago. It was probably months ago now where officers lost sight of each other and a cop ended up shooting another cop. Like he saw the cop, thought he was the suspect and shot him because you lose a lot of situational awareness when you don't have eyes on what's going on. Try to avoid that when you can. The safety thing. That first cop died. Fucking Right shit. there at the door. And then uh other guy survived, but with like long term injuries. Oh sure, yeah. yeah, dude. Um and then the suspect took the first officer's rifle and shot himself in the head with it. So well, that's good. Well, at least Sweet. he did everybody yep. a favor there, but I don't know, man. In a situation like that, there wasn't much that, honestly, that contact officer there, I don't know that there's anything they could have yeah, done. The dude was waiting for him. Thing. Yeah, that's what I mean. So. We had a break in. Okay, where are they oh, breaking? God bless that dude. This chick here with a stick? Yeah. Jeez. Unlocked? Uh, it looks like it. Okay. It's a wooden katana. So I told him to bend down and grab the drink in his backpack, and he came this way and he was pretty stuck. There's a report so far, right? And he was going through the whole of his phone. Okay. You know, like, to find money. Always team and then secure he took it first. His tablet. He took a tablet. Yeah. These are all the DoorDash and Uber. Yep. And he had the tablets. It's all gone. That looks like right. it separates, yeah, dog. She might have a sword oh, yeah. in there. Bet that food is bomb. Yeah. I bet that food is top notch. The back door. Because I didn't see him going this way, so he Just by looking at the menu. Not with the chunkla. This is not the chunkla type of people, dog. <laughs> well, I guess they're chunkla type of people, but they don't call it the chunkla. Mm-hmm. <laughs> All right, so there's no damage on that back door or anything. It just might have been left unlocked. I hope yeah. that's a sword. Kind of looks like, like one. Yeah. yeah, I did. He just took stuff. I don't know what he took. Okay, are you guys going to be here for a minute? Yeah. Okay, I'm going to go see if I can find more of a jack box, and we'll go from there, okay? Dr. Jun Jun, is that just a wooden stick, or is that hiding a sword? Tell us. Tell us. Speak to us from your experience. That NBC looks familiar. Yes, it does. Shout out to Panasonic. Bro. He's on it. Wait, please show me your hands. Show me your hands. He was pointing. That? Yeah. that guy was yeah. pointing. <laughs> yeah. Get on the ground now. Get on the ground. You're under arrest. On the ground. Get on the ground. Damn. Ford fucking that car gets it. Now. What part of the make, dog. You're not free to leave. No oh, we skipped the good stuff. Yeah, you didn't listen. 281 in custody. Maybe listen. Huh? You guys killed my cousin. Maybe cousins. listen. You guys killed my cousin. We cousins. couldn't be any more expressive. It's all yeah. on video. Oh. Congratulations. Someone you guys got pew pewed. Oh, no, we didn't. Hmm? I didn't do nothing, no. Nobody killed your cousin. He said, oh, no, we didn't. Man. Jeez. <laughs> Man. Just listen. I didn't do nothing, Wait, man. One in custody. Where is cousin? But I didn't do want... nothing, no. Comply. Listen, we tell you to stop, you stop. Man, it's really nothing, that man. simple. Where's... I, know what I didn't do nothing, man. Uh-huh. I just left one more. Wait, yeah. <laughs> I'll tell you where I you did. left. Okay, whatever you say. I got a receipt. Hey, for me. Pat on the back. I got a receipt. <laughs> I didn't even see from Walmart. Were you I just left Walmart. Hey, son, we're going to read you your rights. Okay? Man, sir, I didn't do nothing. We're gonna read I just left Walmart. We're yeah. going to read you your rights. You want me to keep, keep myself like a broken record? Man, this is so fucked up, man. Absolutely. You should have stopped. I didn't do nothing wrong. Comply. Bro, this was Yeah, the rights remain silent. That's why you run, right? No, hey, so you man. got your bubble in your pocket, too, bro. I didn't burglarize nothing. We're looking at, we had the owner call us. 
Same vest on. Nobody else wearing the same Bro, vest. Bro, and also like well, burglarizing a restaurant, man. Go to the store. Why, 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 that's why, working, why people. Teriyaki shop. I wasn't in the teriyaki shop. You weren't in the teriyaki shop. I promise you, I wasn't in the teriyaki shop. Okay. Well, then you don't have anything in your backpack, works. right? No, okay. I have no teriyaki okay. shit. It's not teriyaki related. So, they didn't see him out inside. Outside of the. He's resisting yeah, he's a injuring an officer. Need medical check you out. I'm just scared. Everybody's got guns on. It's crazy. It's just a teriyaki person. He's got a. Right across the street. Yeah. Uh, I ain't doing nothing, man. I ain't doing nothing. Community policing, dog. Down from oh, Walmart. I got a Walmart receipt in my pocket. So how's the how's the timing going to be the same? I promise you, I got a Walmart receipt in my pocket. How's the timing going to be the same? It can't be. You don't have anything from that teriyaki shop, right? I don't, man. I promise you, I have nothing from that teriyaki shop. Well, that's the claiming in the video. Shop. I promise. You. Look, Where do you have? Stop, we would have stopped talking to you, right? And she, I, I, said you I, chose I, to run. I was panicking, man. I was, I was, you guys started. You just, I, I, I was going. If, if I was in that, man. I don't know. I don't know yet. Just make. How would I be sitting there waiting for the bus, man? Right there. That don't make no right. sense. Let's do this. We'll work on your hands. You don't have ID on yet. Did they find something right, on him? Do that, man. Doesn't sound like it. I, I, hold on, hold on, stop. Okay, can I finish? Yeah. Then we'll kick you. Cut off. We so. haven't. We just kind of looked through it. He's under arrest, so okay. I'm searching him. But all right, RP said that uh, three tablets were taken from there. Yeah, that's what they told me too. Oh, okay. Um, but yeah. you guys haven't checked it yet. I haven't gone all the way through it. I know. Okay. I'm still working on his pockets. RP. You would know if there were sure tablets in there. You'd figure that out pretty quickly. Oh, okay. Well, the, she, the bottom half of it matches, but she remembers him wearing a black jacket and not a red one. Even it though was, I saw in the, the call, ruh ruh. Right? Okay. Trayvon, can I explain he something? He said hundred percent. Man, this is so fuck. Listen to Why would I do that? Fucking liar, man. Oh, you can't. You can't. We got a laptop. You can't tell me you saw me in that Seven? restaurant, sir. I can't, man. Look, look at the receipt. Look at the receipt right there. How the fuck is the receipt match? You know, save the time. If I was in the fucking restaurant, man, think about it. Think about it, man. Come on, man. I was at Walmart, man. Do we have tablets or no? Ask the description. <laughs> this is very easily figured out. If, if you guys. This is like two hours ago. I got another receipt too. I was in here for hella. I had to go back in. Okay. We can investigate Whoa. that. Was, that was, what are these man? for? That's for my bike. I was up there working on my bike. Okay. The fucking security guard was out there with me for hella working on my bike. The funny thing is Walmart has, dude, Walmart has top tier security cameras. Sure do. Walmart's got better cameras than anybody. Yeah. They also have very good loss prevention. Yes. It shouldn't take that long to figure out. Yep, this is 22.59. That's still half an hour. But where are the tablets going? So half an hour, so it couldn't be me on that on that thing. No. No. Dude, half an hour after you left Walmart, you came down here, and guess what? We have cameras all over the city. Yes, and so like I saw you inside the business. Oh my god, you did that city. All right. Oh my god, what are man? This is crazy. Fucking store. Get them up and finish your band, weapons, drugs. I want to avoid that for you, okay? Have a Let's go. This is stupid, man. Is. There I am. Oh, man. I That's dash. Mm-hmm. We'll have a chat once he's in okay. the car. I didn't, I wouldn't be in the fucking store. store. Okay. You guys want to press Dude. charges on the guy yeah, for the burglary? Oh, oh, he is? Yeah. Because they we, we got the guy. Yeah. We got him. Did you, though? That's what I'm trying to figure out. Do we have the body of the crime? <laughs> Scares everything. I don't know. It's a ghost. <laughs> it's the um, real burglar. It would be really nice to get the tablets back. Yeah.
So uh, my partners, before they're going to take him anywhere, like to jail or anything, they're going to search his backpack. If we find him there, we'll give him. Have we not his backpack? We we'll, uh, once you find out that what are you talking like, about? Number, How do you know it was him if you don't have the tablets? Like. Him at a later time, we'll maybe he hiding somewhere. Maybe, maybe. maybe. Possibly. Officers question this does have very nice cameras. You guys want guy to go to jail for what he did. You guys want to press charges for But if you've never seen Walmart's loss prevention room, what, what is better for him? I mean, what is I better for him? Think, and this is just these guys to check his backpack. Uh, I mean, he committed a crime and he should, you know, pay the price for it, which is jail time. Uh, you know, if people don't press charges like on Toad from these Mario. criminals, then they think nothing's going to happen and they're just going to continue yeah. to do that. And maybe not to you, but to someone else, yeah. to someone else. So nothing changes. They only get, uh, if they don't get caught and people okay, don't want to prosecute, they only get bolder and bolder and do uh, bigger. You know, since you're very young, you check that. Done here. Go grab some. Let me go grab the paperwork. Okay. Is it okay if I leave? Yes, please. If you guys can open the front Did door, we not I'll have the... that way. What? When I come back. Wow. So no tablets? It's not. I don't know how I feel about this one. Two different receipts occurred before. Yeah, I was trying to read the description and all it does is just describe the video, but it doesn't tell us anything else. Also, I'm looking at the rewatching the security camera footage. His, I feel like his hat's different. Let me see. I don't know, man. That's weird. That's a weird one. That's one that Warrior begged for us to play. I I want... If you match the description and you're in the immediate vicinity in a timely manner, sure. You're going to get taken into custody, and even if they get squarely, some force is going to be applied. But, like, you don't, you don't take them unless, like... He's not you got the pretty same hard evidence. Like you know, that pretty hard evidence that like this is your guy. You just don't take anybody just because it's convenient. Uh, that's my only. That's my issue with that. That was a pretty weak investigation. Video. Yeah, a pretty weak investigation for a felony charge. Yeah, Officer Nathan. Bro's wearing a black jacket, not red. Officer Nathan gets it. Yeah, dude. Yeah, yeah I literally watched. Yeah, he was also wearing a hat with a poof, not a. Yeah. Oh, I don't think they got Those the right guy. Taking them into prison charges. Yeah. yeah. He's got to be new. That's my guess, dude. All stroke, no climax. Blake Forge. Yeah, I, I um, if I was a sergeant approaching that, I'd be like, do we have evidence that he actually took anything? Do we have anything from there? Then cut this guy loose. Take the report, get him ID, but. Taking the car, I like it. There's Chase him. Get on the ground, roll, please. Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. push. Uh... Push, push, push. Get on the ground. Push, push. Get on the ground, push. Uh, maybe not in that hoodie, but push. Yeah. Gotta catch him first. Oh, there you go. There it is. No, the I mean, you the don't. It's on the ground. On the ground. Yeah. Bye, Pam. Bye, Pam. Bye, Pam. We love you. Get off the fucking... Get off the radio. Shots fired just east behind the restaurant. He said get, get off the fucking radio. Uh, cops yep. code four. Suspect shot in the stomach. Stay with oh, me, they were bud. fighting over it. Okay. He had it in his... Oh, you can see where it smoked him. Huh? Yep. Okay, okay. Hang with me, bud. What's your name? Let's handcuff this guy. He could get a shot of adrenaline and car, become right? a big problem. I'm cuffing this guy. Please. We're cuffing this guy. And then work on him. He's got my arms on dead. Okay, okay. Do you have any other weapons? No. Okay, okay. His legs are moving, so he didn't take it in the spine, but that's a bad spot to get shot. Yeah. Here. How old are you, bud? 
Do you know your birthday? Sternum rub. Do you know your birthday? Sternum rub. Keep him awake. He pulls a pellet gun? Yep. Sure looked like a real gun, though. Yeah. Let's face it's an airsoft it's gun. <sighs> Why would he do that? Don't. Bro. Yeah, I shot one shot. There's a shot. gun behind me that probably needs Yeah, that's his. That's his gun. Okay. Should we not secured that yet? It's, it's a stressful situation. I'm not mad at him, but... Yeah. Oh, you can also slow everybody down. Somebody needs to get on the radio and slow these guys down. They're going cold. That might four be the ambulance. Oh, okay. Might be. These guys witness. That it. sounds like fire. Um, Keep him talking hey the guys, situation. I agree so completely. Can chat with you? Do you mind hanging out for a minute? Please? Thank you so much. Yeah, just turn them up. It's a good way to keep people awake. <sighs> I have no idea why the fire truck responded. I don't even know if we should be said paramedic on it, so I, took him to the I think we might need to separate. You two? Yes. Okay. You good though? Yeah, I think so. okay. I need an right here. Oh, they're gangs. Now. Gangs in blue. Doing chest compressions by himself, yeah, dude. Fine with your uh, fucking eye investigation. Jeez. In that situation, don't run from cops. Don't pull guns. Um, I will. I will say. I don't think pushes anything. make sense. Well, we get another view of this here. He almost ate it there. He's got his hand on it the whole time. Get on the ground, you fucking idiot! I'm sorry! I'm dead! Oh, help me take his hospital! Please! Get it! Get it! Get it. I can't breathe out! Get off me! Grab me! Here you go, Bill! Oh, let's not put the gun on the ground. Yes, there you go. He's in a shitty situation. I don't want to critique it too much because you're just you're in a shooting that close and that close and that close of proximity. Just east behind the restaurant. Give me Jeez. medical fast. All right. I yeah. See it, I mean, but... I mean, that's gonna be a justified use of force, but it's yeah. a shitty situation. Yeah, that sucks. Um, I'll hang out with you guys in the after party for a little bit. I'm gonna play a little bit of Ready or Not. Um. Free advice for everybody that's here: use use cars when available to to end pursuits, especially if they're foot chases. That makes it a lot easier. Yeah. Uh, push people, don't tackle them. Like in this situation, and to be only robbers for a little bit, do not pull a gun when you're in a foot chase. It's just not a good way. That is a great way to shorten your lifespan. Um, that being said, like I I don't I don't really I don't know if like. We gotta do community outreach, just like tell kids not to have fake guns. Like it's just a terrible idea. Because like really, like let's say you're not interacting with the police, but you're interacting with like somebody on the street and you pull a gun on them, like somebody can anybody can perceive that as a deadly threat and can treat you like it is. So um anyways, thank you to everybody who stopped by. Uh thank you uh, to all the new people. We have a couple new people here in the chat, which I appreciate. Um, we do this every single Thursday at uh, 7.30 Central Standard Time. Ish, ish. ish. Um, very big ish. Uh, we also do Tuesdays. We have Tactical Tuesdays where we play video games and cool stuff like that. And then hopefully um, we will get some produced content. I have been very busy and Bill has been very busy and producer Juan has been very busy. So it's been very hard to get time to do it. But we're going to try to get some of that stuff recorded soon. Uh, I have some admin skit ideas that we'll probably also do and start releasing that on YouTube. Um, Thank you to all of our new subscribers, too. We've been just slowly climbing up on our way to 5,000 subscribers, so I appreciate that. And then last but certainly not least, our Patreon group. Our Patreon is as little as a dollar a month. That gives you access to our Discord. Our Discord is where we hang out and share deals and all that kind of stuff and uh, swap war stories, and it is where the after party happens. 
and we can say things we cannot say on the internet. <laughs> so for the rest of you, <laughs> we'll go hang out with you guys in the OCFT. If you guys want to know what that is, you have to join that group. Awesome live, guys. Thank you for the content. Keep it up. I appreciate it. And then I'll, for the DFW people, we'll go ahead and we'll hang out and go say hi to DFW people. I owe a couple of people a meetup. Uh, Keith and Dr. June June, uh, principal of them. So until next time, thank you for writing that four man, three man with us today. Until next time, peace. You're bad with letters and numbers. Bro, I'm trying. I'm trying. <laughs> Two, it's been three, a long week. Four. It's been a long week. Yeah, I get it. <laughs>